that's pretty well centered there. All right, what's up, YouTube people? All right, let me get this light on. Much better. Okay. All right, so we are ready to rock and roll for tonight. Um, no, there's not a lot of people here. But before we get started, I just want to show off a couple things. I got this in the mail today. Yeah, so ten ten months on this stack here, and I and then this too. So this was a a gift from Upper Deck to me. They uh, I was telling you guys about the article they wrote for me or about me on my Art of the Ages set. Uh, and they were kind enough to send me a very nice care package, even though I told them that they didn't need to. Um, but they sent me this this one to add to my collection, which is a great one. Didn't have this artist yet, uh, Thomas Gainsborough. And uh, I love it. So I just wanted to give a big shout-out to them. Thank you so much. Really awesome. Um, definitely didn't need to do this. Totally unexpected. And I very much enjoy it. And I will love it and cherish it forever in my little museum here on my uh, my wall. So that was thing number one. What's up, Kami? Uh, before we get a backup in the queue, I'm just really quickly, I just want to, um, quick grading thing. Um, I know I tell you guys all the time, you guys ask me to check stuff for grading for you guys. Um, one thing I don't really like about the internet world is a lot of people tend to be um, self-proclaimed uh, grading experts. Um, and we'll give people a lot of bad advice. So just to kind of give you guys an idea of my grading abilities, this was a... 17 card order um, and this is how we did so this was this took nine months or ten months to get back to us and um, generally I only send to, uh, send stuff to BGS if I find a very small imperfection that I think will stop it from getting a PSA 10 so these are kind of like my PSA rejects that are still good enough and really close so this is a uh, this is kind of my results here so we got this Priya Ferguson purple auto 9510 from stranger things uh, Millie Bobby Brown, 9510 from Stranger Things. A uh, Martin Brenner, 9510, number to 25 from Stranger Things. This Jeff Akuta, Tenacious D from Leaf Metal, 9510, I think this is 20, 15, 5 of 15 on the Akuta. Uh, Lamarcus Aldridge, select gold to 10 from 14 15, 3 of 10. Bummer on this one, just a LeBron base 9. It's a little bit off center, but what are you going to do? And then some of my favorite cards Mosaic, in it to win it, of Lillard in the 9 5. Uh, it's pretty sweet. Select Emmett Smith Dragon Scale Prism. It's a jersey number, 22 of 88 in a 9 5. So this was a long time ago. No joke, these cards cost me under $10, which is why I sent them without subgrades. And I, like I said, these were my PSA rejects that still looked good enough. So that's why I sent them without subgrades. Um, it was half the price of what subgrades, it was less than half the price of what subgrades costed at the time when we submitted them. So these were under $10 to grade, which is an unfathomable thought, uh, probably at this price. Kami, I'll get to you in just one second. We're almost done here. Um, this is probably the best card, dollar-wise, in the order, is this Lucas Stain Glass. From Mosaic, so a really sharp card there. That one will probably be staying in my PC. Uh, Lillard Overdrive. Yeah, I know, crazy, right? $8 to grade a card. Seems like it was so long ago. Trey Young in it to win it. More 9.5s. 9.5 Simmons in it to win it. Uh, Siakam Optic Rookie 9.5. This Town Stairmasters, which got a 9. It's the Stairmasters Mosaic. Uh, Montage Mosaic Tatum, 9.5. A Blue Chips Zion Mosaic, 9.5. And the final card, a cool one that I liked. Uh, so, 1617 Aficionado Artist Proof Purple Jeremy Lin, but it is 7 of 99 jersey number in a 9.5. So, I did, I hit 15 out of 17. Overall, the cards I checked for everyone, I hit 91%. 9.5s are better. And I want to say probably out of the, I would probably say 5% of the cards that we missed on, we knew were going to be nines. So just to kind of give you guys an idea of my um, grading ability, I'm not blowing smoke up your butts uh, when I tell you things. 
<laughs> about that. So, <laughs> all right, let's get to some of Kami's packs here. And I'm gonna leave my Goodwin Champions art card out on display. It's a big thank you to Upper Deck for the rest of the night here. So, and let's slide them over just a little bit further for the stream. There we go. All right, so Kami's got a couple items here. Starting off with some Prism Multipacks. So this is the other half of the box from yesterday. Um, and pretty much everything I have in the store for today is pretty much all that I have. I have a couple items that I have more of, but not a ton. Um, go ahead, Kami, you can pick two, one through six. Um, one, no huddle, no huddle. We sold, I think we sold one set of packs. Oh, we did. We sold one set of packs. Um, we hit the auto, which didn't matter at all because it was a common $1 auto of Michael Warren. Um, but the auto is gone. The variation in all the numbered cards are still there. And uh, the funny thing is, is that's one of the products where I think the numbered cards are generally more valuable than the auto in most boxes. So I'm really not too... Uh, it's fine. I'm just happy for whoever pulled it. I can't remember who it was, but I was happy for him. Um, but yeah, it's actually... If it was me, that would not be a deterrent to purchasing um, No Huddle. Palomalu, Bell, Doyle, Derwin James, Tannehill, Barkley, Shaq Thompson, Bosworth, Ronald Jones, a green. Tyrod Taylor, that is... Mm. Well, starting, starting with a fake out. Chargers quarterback, Tyrod Taylor. Oh, man, they're just insulting us now. More Chargers stuff that isn't Justin Herbert. Keenan Allen, Brilliance. And Marlon Davidson. If that was Joshua Kelly, I would have just signed off for the day. What's up, Pat? Thanks for hanging out with us, buddy. I don't know if anyone else is on right now. Don't even know. Ooh, we got a green insert here. I think it's a green brilliance. Maybe a green brilliance. I think so. What's up, Bobbers? Fells, Martin, Chubb, Chubb, <laughs> Dub Chubbs, <laughs> little double Chubb. Lane Johnson, Josh Jacobs, Kamara, Sanders, Rondé Barber, and our green brilliance is Devontae Parker. Good player. Jersey match like that. Emergent Chase Young, another good player. And Anthony uh, McFarlane Jr. He might, he might be starting for the Steelers. They got rid of Connor, so they might be in line to be the starter this year. Speaking of people that are in line to be the starter... Get your Jordan Loves out. Uh, 2020 football just took another huge boost um, with the Aaron Rodgers news today. So I sold a, I had a card listed for $250 of Jordan Love for a year, a full year. And um, I saw the news. I got like five offers at 150 bucks. Declined them all. I raised the price to 400 and someone had to buy it now in 10 minutes. So, if you got some Jordan Loves, now is a good time to sell. Uh, Galladay, Harris, and Gross Matos, Red, White, and Blues. Let's get something for Kami to start this off. Patrick Mahomes, come on. Minshew, my little Cooper Cup. And a player that I like, Xavier McKinney for the Giants. You can wait for the season. I mean, you can. The thing is, with a player like that who is generally regarded as overdrafted, thanks, Kami. I appreciate you starting us off, buddy. Um, I'm going to be working hard today to find everyone's stacks, so bear with me. There's Tommy. Um, he's a player who's overdrafted, so there's really no, no guarantee that, you know, um, he's going to be the starter come training camp or in, in line to be the starter. I mean, they could go sign someone, they could trade for someone, they could draft someone tonight. You never know. Um, but literally nothing happened to Jordan Love. Uh, DMS, you can pick one through four. Nothing happened. Jordan Love did literally nothing and his cards doubled. So, that's a, that's a time when I generally say sell because I've been doing this long enough that I can tell you 99 out of 100 quarterbacks, um, you sell before the opportunity as opposed to after. Boss RP, what up, fellas? All right, DMS, good luck. All 
Got a silver here. All right. Quinn Williams, Leonard Green, Smith, Tate Hill, Samuel White, Kyle Rudolph, and... Oh, my God. Well, that's how you start things off. Hot diggity. Herbert Silver. And it's off center, but I mean, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Oh yeah, definitely. I mean, that's a that's a good card. Jacobs and J.K. Dobbins and the red, white, and blue for you, DMS. Wow, good start to the night. Um, I saw someone ask about Bowman, Uzuma, Prescott. Oh my God, what a pack! Silver Herbert and a red, white, and blue Burrow, also off center, unfortunately. But I mean, I don't think you can really complain about that. I think Silver Herberts are up over 500 bucks. Let me pull up a... We'll get our price checker ready here. I can just tell from looking at the card right away. The border. The top border. See how small it is and see how big the big the bottom border is? Uh, yeah, I think... I, I would... The last time I checked Silver Herberts, they were like 700 bucks, but it's been quite some time. I never want to overshoot. Yeah, so... Let me... Give me one second here. Ah! Alright. Let's sort these bad boys. the card number 30325 so the last one raw did 510 PSA 9 did 900 so pretty much I was spot on for that it's, it's a little over uh, probably a little over 500 raw since it's going to be it's obviously off center um, so Good card. And the burrows are pretty sweet too. Congrats, DMS. Uh, you didn't have a stack from yesterday, right, buddy? I'm going to be asking everyone that today just to help me find stuff, but I'm 99% sure you did not. No. Uh, I would say no to both of those. They're too far off center to uh, to consider. Yeah, Kami. I. <laughs> yeah. Both. I know. Crazy. I know you've been working this box pretty hard. Let's see if we can find something for you in here. Oh no! Oh no! All right, well, you you have one more purchase left in you at least. Um, one, two, or three. Me pick. All right, let's go. I'll go at the bottom. Uh, but so whoever was asking about Bowman, the top players uh, you're looking for are um, Austin Martin, Blaze Jordan, Mick Abel, Nick Maton, and Aaron Sabato. Uh, Martin being the best far and away. Uh, Sabato and Jordan probably your second best, maybe a tie. And then uh, Abel and Maton are going to be after that. And then there's a there's a lot of solid players in there, but no, most of these guys, they haven't played baseball in a full year, so it's really hard to... Uh... Oh, you got a second one here too, buddy? Okay, I see you. Um, they, haven't, um, they haven't played baseball in at least like a full year because there was no minors last year. Some of them haven't played at all. So it's, it's kind of hard to fully evaluate the product yet. But I got you here, Tommy. Sorry, buddy. I was a little, little distracted. All right, let's start with the first pack here. Brunel, Landry, Van Noy, Sanders, Duvernay, Tardif, Allen Robinson, uh, Jelani Tavai, JPP, Anthony Harris, and 
Emerging Green, LaVisca Chenault Jr., Daniil Hunter Unstoppable, and Daryl Taylor Rookie. Second main pack is Beasley, Ward, White, Haskins, Johnson, Jones, Higby, Jarrett, uh, Eric Armstead, and Mitch Trubisky. Green, McLaurin Brilliance, and Bradley and I for the Cowboys. Let's get some red, white, and blue magic for Tommy here. Juju, Strahan, like that card, and Devin Duvernay. One more try. Deontay Johnson, Deshaun Jackson, and Kyle Duggar. So that is going to do it, my friend. I will add them to your stack. Yeah, I hate that they use the combine. No problem, Kami. I hate that they use the combine cards for um for Prism. All right, Bobbers is gonna do one of my last optic fat packs. So pretty much everything that I have in this store is the last that I have, with the exception of like I think maybe four or five products over there for packs at least. Boxes, I might have a couple more, but two. I don't think that's ever going to happen again, Tommy. That was the most ridiculous uh, retail pack I've ever opened in my whole life. Don't know if that makes you feel better or worse, but... All right, Bobbers. Galladay, Gronk, Julio, Gilmore, Mayfield, Watson, Kerrigan, Goff, Tredavious White, Taysom Hill, and a silver of Drew Locke, followed by... Not bad. Rated rookie of Edwards Alaire. That was a solid pack. We got a silver instead of a green and an Edwards Lair for Bobbers. Drafts about the star. I can't wait to put that on and kind of half watch. I'm going to apologize probably a hundred times today to you guys for being slow trying to find everyone's stacks from yesterday. Uh, DMS going to go one more time with Prism. Alright, this is the last one I got. So we are out of Prism multi-packs. Just like that. Done. With Prism multi-pack. Alright, we got a green insert. Ogden, Diggs, Joku, Landon Collins, Hunter Henry, Amendola, Kirk Cousins, Cooper Cup, Dante Fowler, and one of my favorite players in the league, Fireworks of Aaron Donald, Green. Uh, no, Obax. No Huddle's its own product. I'll tell you about it in just a minute here. Justin Jefferson, Emergent, rookie. Nice one there. And Cole Kmet. And a red, white, and blue. Roquan Smith. Kirk Cousins, and Anthony Gordon. So definitely not as good as the first pack, but Donald, best player in football, and uh, Justin Jefferson. So, Oh, you're okay, buddy. Uh, so No Huddle is a hobby product. Um, it's an 18-card box. It's got about five or six numbered cards per box. All the numbered parallels are numbered to 79 or less, which is why I love it. Um, regular Prism, you're going to get parallels all over the place. The 275, 199, 175, 149. It's a, it's a shit show of, of high-numbered, unvaluable items. Prism Fast Break is the opposite. Everything is numbered to 79 or less. Um, and they also have, I want to say it's, I think you get 12... It's 10 or 12 total prisms per box, so you'll either get the numbered ones or the, um, they're called no huddle prisms. They basically, they're what people generally refer to on the secondary market as disco. Um, they have like little circles in the background, uh, very cool looking cards. Um, so that's like the silvers of that. Then you get one true silver prism per box, you get one auto per box, and one photo variation per box. It's literally like loaded with all kinds of stuff. Um, that's probably my favorite thing. If I was quarterback chasing for, you know, if I'm factoring the 
potential big hit, um, the value, um, and the actual cost of the items, and the floor of the product. That's that's without a doubt my favorite one personally for what I at least for what I have here. Um, Select is another good one. It's a little bit more higher end, um, but that that would be the other one that I I would recommend. All right, Bobbers is doing two more optics. No problem, buddy. All right, pick two, my friend. One through four. All right, going bookends. Ooh, and then Mark's going into the new box of Bowman Jumbo. Sweet. Well, looks like we got a boring pack. Moore, Watson, Kerrigan, Goff, White, Hill, Christian Fulton rookie. Aaron Rodgers going uh, on his way out of Green Bay. Derrick Henry, Max Crosby, Lamar Jackson, and Cortland Sutton. We got another silver. Wow. Tannehill, Eckler, Marquise Brown, Drew Brees, Tommy Toughnuts, Cousins, Khalil Mack, Jamison Crowder, Stafford, Cooper Cup, and our silver is... We can't do it again, can we? It's blue. Okay. So there's no way we do it again, right? Darius Leonard. Great player, though. And a Darius and Evans rated rookie. Nice. So thank you for that, Bobbers. And I'm going to get some uh, brand new product, like stuff we haven't had yet, uh, the next restack I, or restock I can do. No problem, my friend. Always happy to have you here. All right, DMS is going to try no huddles. <sighs> Left, right, one through eight. Pick two, my friend. Two, right and left. All right. Let's do it. All right, so we got a numbered card right out the gate. Very nice. John Brown, Evan Ingram, Richard Sherman, and a red of Cleveland Farrell, number four overall pick in the 2019 draft. A rookie of J.K. Dobbins. So solid pack, Dobbins rookie. And the Feral is 27 of 50. So I can almost guarantee you, like, if this was a box of hobby, this Cleveland Feral would probably be the lowest numbered card you hit in the whole box of hobby. And it's probably going to be, like, the third third or fourth lowest numbered card we hit here in this box, which is why I absolutely love Prism No Huddle. Darren Fells, Derek Carr, Daniil Hunter, and a No Huddle, Go Hard or Go Home of Michael Thomas. So this is the go harder, or excuse me, the uh, this is the no huddle silver, the background that you see. It's just a, like a regular silver prism, but it has all these little circles. And Clavon Chase on, not too shabby. Dobbins is nice. So is the Feral. Contenders, too. I, whoever was asking about quarterback chasing, I already forgot. I'm like losing my mind. We're only like 20 minutes into the stream. Contenders, obviously, 2020 is the ultimate risk-reward contenders chase. But, I mean, you can literally get $1 worth of cards out of three packs for 100 bucks or whatever I have in the store, is, or in the store at right now. So, All right, Mark. Um, I need you to, before you pick your packs, or your pack, I need you to pick a box. Pick box one or box two. I opened two brand new boxes um, since I, I put them out um, by the by the individual pack and by the lot of two. All right, so box two is the one that does not have the display pack up front. So I already shuffled these up. So go ahead and take your pick left, right, one through six. Right, five. All right. Good luck. Good luck, good luck, good luck. Did a Super Fractor Auto yesterday. I would love to do it again. 
four super fractors already this week. Maybe no, five? Four or five. F one racing, Bartolo Cologne, Aledmus Diaz, the Zach Veen Auto. I think four. Gotta get the five. Alright. Bellinger, Donaldson, Nola, Gallo, Vlad, Robert, Freeman, Bubik, Stevenson, and Tejada and Bart and Pearson rookies, five in a row. Bogarts and Goldschmidt. Asa Lacey Futurist. Kalenic eighty nine. Patino top 100. And a nice chrome. Blaze Jordan, first Bowman. Uh, someone bought three packs from it yesterday. They hit a no-name sticker auto. I can't even remember who it was. Some some guy that they said might potentially lead the league in tackles in like eight years. I don't think he played a snap all year. Jordan Adams, Dylan Dingler, Zamora, Hunter Bishop, Luciano, Arias, Cruz, Gilbert, Terang, Pagero. That's a first, even though it doesn't have the logo. Patrick Bailey, Cower, Kerstad, and Kevin Alcantara. Uh, the box is listed, not by packs. That was a little bit too expensive uh, for me to drop down into packs. Uh, it's almost a thousand dollar box, so that one I left sealed, but it is listed. So thank you for the purchase there, Mark. Let's get to Ovax for Heritage High. He's going to get, get four packs there. No problem, Mark. All right, 18 Heritage High. So left, right, one through six, he got four. You hear Obex? Yeah. Obex, you hear, buddy? The queue isn't long. Okay, there you go. He's back. You're all good. No worries at all. It's just, uh, there's no way for me to see who's physically in here right now, so I can't tell. I just have to keep asking. <laughs> okay, I pick. All right, I'm going to pick two. I'm going to have my wife pick two. She's down here with the dogs behind me. All right, Lisa, pick uh, two numbers. You have one through five, left and right. Two and four. Which side? Right. All right. Wifey says right, three, four. Let's see how we do. I'll open my packs first and then watch her packs destroy mine. We have two dogs. We have um, They're both adopted. They're both mixes. One's uh, a boxer mix. But he kind of looks like a pit bull. He's like 70 pounds. He's got, his name is Dixon, but we also call him Big Head because he's got a giant-ass head. And uh, the other one, his name is Heinz. He's like 35 pounds. He's uh, They told us he was a Chihuahua mix, but he more looks... Eh. What did they say you think they think he was, Lise? Maybe Terrier. Like a, maybe a Terrier mix. Not long at all, Baroni. There's only a couple people. But he's like... Heinz is like 35 pounds. Very smart, Heinz is. Uh, very nice start here. Glaber Torres, so my pack's doing well. Chatwood, Listella, Barnes, Miracle of 69, Seaver. It's probably the best one you can get from that set. Anibal Sanchez, Christian Arroyo, Max Stassi, and Wade Davis. Yeah, but we're very big dog people here in the, uh, the Buffy household. That's also why I really love this painting, that upper deck sent me. You can't really see too well, but there's a little dog in the left corner. So it's the first one that I've gotten that has a dog. Uh, Moran, Blandino rookie, Rasmus, McKinney rookie, and another Glaber. So two Glabers and an Otani. You're in trouble, Lise. I did well. I might beat you. Ionetta, Nishek, and Trevor Kale. Yeah, I love dogs. They're like my favorite things. Dogs and cards. Cabrera, J.W. Eunice, Liriano, Ronald Guzman rookie, and an Ichiro Deckel. Mark Melanson, Malik Smith, uh, Hirano, and Eric Lohr. Let's go. All right, final pack here. Axford, Brockstar, Jordan Hicks rookie, Jesse Biddle rookie, 
Eric Hosmer, should be a short print, it is. AJ Minter, rookie. Joe Jimenez, Jaime Garcia, and Cesar Hernandez. So not too shabby. Two Torreses and an Otani. Uh, yeah, that's not a real auto. That's a facsimile. It's just a, that's just the design of the card. Wow, I found your stack right away. That was very lucky. Got like 70 different stacks here just from yesterday and the beginning of today. Hosmer is having a year. I mean, I feel like that whole team is just mashing. Uh, all right, so S. Brenker and then Baroni. So S. Brenker for Bowman Jumbo. Do you want box one or box two? Box one, all right. So box one is this one. One through six, take your pick. Right two. What's up, Lise? How do I do? Uh, you did okay. Nothing crazy, but you did all right. Let's see what we got here. Yeah. All right. Robert, Freeman, Hoke, Huff, Varsho, Singer, and Baum, rookies, all of those guys. Goldschmidt, Bell, Betts, Bregman, Abreu, Tatis, Rendon, Cabrian Hayes, and we got a purple auto. Don't know who this is. Going to learn with you guys. Brian Buelvas. Buelvis. Buelvas. Uh, three per box. 56 of 250. Born in 02. They just get younger and younger. Number 16 A's prospect. Uh, second in the system. Eight triples. Hit 300 in the Arizona League. Uh, got team MVP. High energy player. Old school mentality. Uh, slaps balls for extra base hits. Threat for steals, good defender with excellent range. He was added to the 60-man roster. It's interesting. And he won the organization's Grinder Award for best worth it, uh, work ethic. Those are all things that I kind of like. So, interesting player. I mean, the back of the baseball card always makes you sound good. But I liked all that. That was nice. I like people who work hard. Got a quick sleeve there for Mr. Buelvas. Nice pick, buddy. I mean, that's got to be pronounced Brian, right? Or Brian? I don't know. I never know. Liberator, Gray, Alvarez, Jordan Walker, Kalenic, Mackenzie Gore, Walston, Nova, Waters, Cower, Kerstad, Alcantara, Kirby, Garcia, Woods, Richardson, and Ronnie Mauricio. I mean, it sounds like he should. It's a profile of someone who I think would. Uh, let me just find your, your stack here, SB. Is all right, and now we're on to Prism Hobby for Baroni, I believe. Baroni for Prism Hobby. All right, buddy, one through four, take your pick. Welcome to uh, to my channel. I believe you're a new guy. Fire, 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 indeed. Bottoms. All right. Haven't seen anything out of this box yet, so nothing noteworthy so far. Let's see if we can change that here. Tobias Harris, Onyeka Okongwu, rookie for the Hawks. Not too shabby there. Duncan Robinson, Bam, Wade, Dejounte Murray, and a silver. Caleb Martin, red. Juan Hernan Gomez should be to 275 or 299 for basketball. 189 of 299. Fireworks of Paul George, DeAnthony Melton, Dwight Powell, and Ursan Ilyasova. That was it, not the fire. That was that was the water. But I appreciate the purchase. Hope you're uh, enjoying the stream, my friend. I'm gonna try one more. All right. One, two, or three. Two. I have two boxes of Bowman out here. Um, so yeah, the one box still has both autos in it, and the other box has all three autos in it. Let's go. I can be your hero buff stuff. Here's an auto. 
And a purple. Purple ice. Alright. Purple ice and an auto. Sometimes you just gotta sing it, you know? I believe Marin Morris said it best. There is a song for everything, including summoning prism cards. Kevin Love, Xavier Tillman rookie, Peyton Pritchard rookie, Kyrie Irving, Zubach, Carmelo, Harden, and your purple ice <clears throat> is Al Horford. We'll check the serial number on that after we do the auto. Uh, Davis Bertans, John Wall, and Paul George. All right. Oh, Mojo Auto. Let's go. Mojo Auto. Just be huge. Huge one time. Good luck. All right. I'll take it. The Horford is 85 of 175. Cassius Stanley, Sensational Signatures Mojo, Rookie Auto to 25. 13 of 25 on the Stanley. It's a solid card. There's the fire. Congrats, buddy. That brings us to SB. Ooh, for Ben Baller. Love Ben Baller. Love me some Ben Baller. Uh, we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Oh, excuse me. Wow. 1 through 16 on Ben Baller. 3, 7. I love that, that everyone now like summons the the Kyle Lowry gods I know I have nothing to do with that it's just kind of random but it's I feel like it's been happening a lot recently makes me feel I feel like a proud dad all right got a refractor oh is, do we have a is that, oh it's an 85 I thought it might have been an auto at first the only time you have like regular refractors like this or autos or 85s um, and it looked thin when I pulled it out of the pack but it's definitely a 1985 Archie Bradley, Corey Seager, and an 85 of Rafael Devers. This guy can hit. Like, he's a just a garbage ball hitter. You throw the ball anywhere near the plate, this guy can hit it. I love Devers. He's so underrated. And Jose Urena. Second pack here is Abreu, Giolito, Schwarber, and Archie Bradley. Devers, nice hit. Those are two per box. Hi, Dixon. And you got the reigning AL MVP as well. I'm going to take half a second here. I just want to get the draft up on my TV. Um, so bear with me, guys. He's so good. No problem, SP. Uh, he should, I mean, he was in the MVP running last time we had a full season. Draft is set up, ready to watch. CMD, that came out of Prism Multi Pack. I don't even have, I don't have any of those left. He could, I mean, a lot of players that are real, 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 real good that never win an MVP. So, come here, Nixon. Come here. Hi. Hey, baby. What are you doing? Yes. Who's a good boy? Yeah, you're a good boy, right? Thank you. All right, so it's it's a stone cold lock, right? That it's uh, Lawrence one and uh, Wilson two. So then after that, I mean, do we all th do we all think Mac Jones goes three? Mac Jones three and Kyle Pitts four. Jay Frank with Jumbo. All right, all right, buddy. I'm gonna go back to work. Okay, baby. You go there with mommy. Talk to my dog like he's a child. 
There's. N I don't think Lance goes three. <laughs> I don't know. We'll, well, we'll find out real soon. Let's get to uh, Jay Frank here with Bowman Jumbo. All right, Jay Frank, do you want um, box one or box two? I have two uh, two different boxes here. Shimmy knows. He's in the loop. Box one or box two, Jay Frank? All right. Left, six, right, five. This is the one, I'm assuming. Three left. Okay. Assuming you wanted the box that it still had the uh, three autos left. Which one has less autos? I want that. <laughs> Good luck, dude. All right. Yastrzemski, Bichette, Bauer, Soler, Sanchez, Kirilov, Garcia, Braylon Marquez rookies, Otani, Blackman, Brian Anderson, Harper, Molina, and Lindor, Nate Pearson, rookie of the year favorites, and not too shabby, Yolbert Sanchez. Base auto. Number 20, White Sox prospect. He's got a card in the base set, too. He's older, I remember, right? Yeah, he's, a, he's an older guy, uh, 97. He's a Cuba defector. So, played three years in the Cuban National League, though. But always good to hit a Bowman auto. He was a teammate of Luis Robert, too, mentioned there on the uh, the card. So, autos are always good. Hendrick, Westberg, or Hendrick is top 100. Westberg, Arias, Veen, Edwards, Abrams, Amaya, Allen, Whitley, Groshans, Jones, Henderson, Blade, Brett Beatty, Jackson, Rutledge, and Austin Wells, 231 of 499. That works. Thanks, buddy. I appreciate the purchase. I'm happy that you're happy. And while we have a, another half a second here, i got to get the Raptors up on my top TV, the Raptors-Nuggets game. Alright. Pittman going into twelve thirteen prestige. Alright. Alright, buddy. Uh, one through fourteen on prestige. Six. Alright, one, two, three, four, five, nine. Six. So no big name rookies yet, still two autos. Um, really nothing notable. Uh, we had a best card by far has been the Isaiah Thomas auto. Best rookie so far has been a Draymond Green. Oh, well, at least can you? Oh, never mind. It's working now. Okay. Good luck, buddy. All right. Big Al, Goran Dragic, Maggetti, Millsap, franchise favorites insert of Mello, and our rookie is... Markeith Morris, still in the league. He's a serviceable guy. Before you know it, Markeith Morris is going to be a 15-year NBA veteran, which is crazy to think. Dwan Blair, owner of zero working ACLs. And another big Al, Al Horford. Oh, Raptors Nuggets is nine. I thought it was on at eight. Hmm. Well, let's put on... I guess we'll put on... No, it's going to be a blowout. That's... I mean, none of these games are going to be good. We'll just watch Mavericks Pistons, I guess. No problem, buddy. Thank you. Watch what Luca on the upstairs TV here. Okay. Butters is leaving us. She's going upstairs. When there's so much buildup to the draft, it almost doesn't feel like it's actually going to happen when it starts. You know what I mean? If you're like, no, 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 we've been talking about the draft for like, you know, 
three months. Can't be tonight. And as soon as this draft is over, there will already be the 2022 way too early mock draft. I mean, maybe if you spell it right, Luke. Maybe. <laughs> I have some Jeremy the Lynn. No, Adam the Lynn. Oh, Adam Thielen, why didn't you say so? <laughs> no, I don't have any Thielens. I know that's just a running joke. You ask everyone, but you got me with that earlier. I told an Adam Thielen story, and they're like, he'd ask everyone if there was a, he just comes in any room, any Adam Thielen, any Adam Thielen. I'll allow it. Ooh, actually, while we have a wall, maybe we can do um, our first ever group break here with something like... Hmm. Maybe something like this. Like, if anyone is interested. So this just has four bat cards per box. Uh, there's doubles, triples, quads, there's autos, there's bat barrels, bat knobs, you name it. Uh, we can do a hit draft, just four spots. It would be, I think, 80... Ooh, that's bad math. 83? Yeah. Bye, Luke. Actually, no, I could probably do it at 80. If anyone is interested... Where are all the people's at tonight? I know I think I think I'm the only one breaking. Maybe it's a little early. Maybe everyone's watching the draft. Oh, we got a couple other people on right now. Nice. Who else is on? When I uh, signed on, there was no one else. There was no one else on. Okay. Cool. 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 Some OGs. Some loop OGs. Uh, MDE, no, nothing from this box at all. Nothing notable. We had a purple of Jack Aitken, I think, is our best card from this box. So I'll set this back off to the side, but if it, we don't have enough people in here right now, I don't think, to do a, uh, a group break. Uh, maybe we'll get a little push notification from the boys, uh, the boys at, uh, in management. Jax, what's going on? Two more minutes, finally, until we can uh, watch two terrible franchises get some quarterbacks. All right, Jax, a little prestige. You can pick one through 13. Welcome back. Hauser, what's up? Just hopping around, I assume. A one through a... Uh, there you go. All right, Jax, number four.
two packs, Mark. Let me see. Um, I don't have anything to do with the what you get charged. Let me see if you bought a second one here. It might have just it might just be a computer thing. I see one. You only got one here on the uh, the purchase screen. You can come in and check if you go to the uh, the sale items and hit purchased. You definitely only have one, so it's probably just a uh, a little glitch um, on um, on the payment processor's end, which usually should go away within one business day. Um, just from my history in the restaurant industry, that would happen all the time. People would see two of the exact same charges showing up, and they just go away. Uh, yeah, it's, it should be a pending charge because so the batch doesn't settle. It doesn't like take money out of your account right away. Um, when you're paying through a processing system like this, um, it won't settle until they settle the batch. So all the payments come in or purchases come in, and then they go through and process it, and then it will hit. It'll actually hit your account tomorrow. So I would say if it's still there tomorrow morning, um, just reach out and contact um, contact the support team, and they will help you out. This is yours, Jax. Correct. Lucky Pack 4. Good luck, buddy. Gordon Hayward, Jose Calderon, Dirk, Hito Turkaloo, Stockton and Malone Connections, Jawan Johnson, rookie. Wow. I think he was from Purdue. Let's flip this over and see if I got that. Purdue? From Purdue. My God. Steph Curry and Courtney Lee. Well, Steph Curry, by far and away, the best card there. Juwan Johnson. That is not a name I ever want to see on a card ever again. Good call. Hey, yeah, definitely. I mean, I remembered him enough to know that he went to Purdue. Um, so, I guess that's something. Not much, but it's something. Uh, let me find your stack here, Jax. I think you had one. Maybe not. What's up, MP? It's good to see you tonight, my dude. You ready for the draft? You watching? Uh, work dinner. Well, I mean, at least it's free dinner. I'm, I'm always down for free dinner. But I'd rather have, I'd rather watch the draft. I'd rather order Chinese food and watch the draft or something. Uh, this is the final pack that I have of a uh, Hoops Jumbo. Um, I know you just popped in, Mike, so um, I just wanted to let you know. I wasn't able to restock or get anything new today. Um, the internet went out of the office. The... Uh, cable company was messing with, or someone was messing with some phone lines, and it knocked out our internet, so I couldn't do anything, so I'm just kind of working with what I had from yesterday, so, all right, well, I will, tr I will try not to spoil anything for you, Nicholson, Brown, Hansborough, Bayless, Bogut, Turner, Mo Williams, let's see, are these upside down, yes, so Turner, Mo Williams, Dennis Schroeder, rookie, Marvin Williams, Jason Terry, second year Jimmy Butler, Shabazz, Tony Snell, Paul George, Steve Blake, Ben McLemore, nice LeBron, Shumpert, Courtney Lee, Fournier, Brandon Knight, Matt Barnes, Dirk, KCP, Duncan, Calderon, Joseph, and Gortat. You literally got like every other good rookie in all of 13, 14 in that pack. That wasn't Giannis. Uh, Larry Sanders and Jimmy Butler action shots. Hoop Dreams of Butler and Jared Sullinger, Hibbert and Larry Sanders board members, class action of Amari and Crawford, Hall of Fame heroes of Isaiah Thomas and Billy Cunningham, and another nice LeBron, courtside, such good photos. I think it was the year after this they made um, they made these like shiny and nice and foily and looking much better. Um, Carmelo Anthony, Kevin Martin, and Nick Young spark plugs, and let's get to our parallels. JV, Jonas Valanciunas, Carl Landry, Robin Lopez, Jeff Teague, and Jeremy Evans, Redbacks, 
Iman Shumpert, Mario Chalmers, and Melo. So two nice LeBrons, a handful of good base rookies. We're going to get you that Giannis one day. Not going to be tonight because I physically can't do it anymore. Can't do it. Definitely not for the lack of trying. That is for 100% certain. Uh, all right, MD. MD Pietro. We're going to do contenders. So eight left, right seven. Pick three. Uh, there's eight on the left, seven on the right. Audio working, you guys can hear me okay? Just want to make sure. I'm gonna type it in for, oh, cool. I'm gonna type it in for MDPA for just in case. Okay, he's got it. There we go. Alright, so bottoms. Alright. Oh, sorry, then you get one more. It's three packs. What am I doing? Yeah, one more. Forgot what we were opening. Third pack. Right four. All right. No, I don't know if you're watching still, Joe. I just saw. Uh, I just saw it over on YouTube. A couple comments. Um, Kayla, how's it going? If you're watching over there still. Um, yeah, you got to get a new phone, buddy. If you can't get the app. All right, MD Pietro. Let's see what we got here. Looking for autos, autos, and more autos. Nick Chubb, Saquon, Darius Leonard, Derek Henry, Jamal Adams, and a round numbers of Justin Jefferson and Jeff Gladney. Tyler Boyd, Kirk Cousins, Alshon Jeffrey, DJ Chark, Ryan Tannehill, and Aaron Donald winning ticket. We got points. Mahomes, Marlon Mack, AJ Green, uh, Marvin Jones, and it's 250 points. That's as far as I'm going to slide it for you. I don't want anyone to steal the code. And Carson Wentz, but 250 points. Oh, squad's here now. Patrick's here. Kitley's here. What's up, guys? Thank you for the purchase, MD. Points do replace an auto for those of you who are uh, kind of new to this and don't know what that is. They will replace an auto, and they're uh, good to be redeemed on the Panini Rewards site, so you can kind of go around and shop and grab uh, whatever it is that you like, that you have enough points for. It's kind of like uh, being at an arcade with tickets. So I think we got some F1 Chrome now. Or oh, UFC is what it was. UFC. For Diminuendo. Oh, yeah. He's like, yeah. Yeah, it's me. All right.
All right, so left, right, one through uh, one through six. You. Yeah, yeah. Left three. All right. Good luck. All right. We got a silver and a blue. I think silvers. I think we only hit two or three silvers in the whole box. Um, yesterday, so. Mike Perry, Jamal Hill, Rafael Asunsao, Marlon Moraes, Johnny Walker, and our blue is Jeff Neal. We'll check the serial number in just a second here. Silver of Mareb Vasilevshi. Neil Blue is 143 of 199, and the Marab Vasilevshi, Silver Rookie. Guy's ripped. The Machine. He's a standout in the Russian, Russian grappling art of Sambo. Never gets tired. Nate Diaz, Fearless. Shogun Rua, Jose Aldo, Jan Blakowicz, and Tiago Santos. I think Fields might be the one who slips. So thank you for that, Diminuendo. My pleasure, buddy. I hope you enjoyed the pack. I don't know the most about UFC. I heard the Patriots were in the mood, or we're going to either, well, people are speculating that they may trade up to grab Lance if he slips. Um, but I wouldn't be surprised if the Patriots... I feel like the Patriots are just going to go with whatever they can get their hands on. Like Whatever quarterback is left at the 7 through 11 range that they can trade up, if they can make that trade, they're going to do it. I don't know which one it's going to be, but that's kind of the vibe I've been getting from the pre-draft reports, which are almost never right, so probably nothing like that at all is going to happen. Basically, whatever we think is going to happen, just throw it right out the window. All right, we are on MTPH again with a couple more contenders. You don't like Cam Newton? All right, so you got six on each side now. One through six, left, right. Pick three. Yeah, I know it was. I remember when people were getting all excited after the first couple games because he uh, he played okay and he was running the ball well. And I remember reading the articles, Cam Newton is a fantasy superstar again. Cam Newton leading the Patriots back to the promised land. Patriots aren't going to miss a beat without Tom Brady because Cam Newton. And, yeah. <laughs> That's funny. Well, I mean, mad props for him to be in so successful without being able to do something like that. But at MD Pietro, you got three here. Bottom on each, okay. And then... Go ahead, snag one more. No, JTC. Not a single one. Top left. All right, good luck. All right, Miles Sanders, Joe Mixon, Tom Brady, Drew Locke. And there's a nice auto. I like that. That's a that's a pretty good sticker auto. I mean, I'm a sucker for, like, the actual game itself. Like, I'm not just like, oh, quarterbacks or nothing else. Jedrick Wills, good player, important person. I'd rather have a Jedrick Wills offensive lineman auto every single day and twice on Sunday, football joke, um, as opposed to just some numb nuts who's never going to see the field. So, nice card there. And a Kinlaw and Ayuk round numbers. All 
I'm so happy that I don't have to listen to Roger Goodell talk right now. He's like just so, so like so unpleasant to hear. I'm a big fan of my TV being on mute right now. Uh, Mike Evans, Philip Lindsay, Josh Jacobs, Gronk, Melvin Gordon, and oh, there he is again. There's the man, Hamler. Hamler and Gross Matos, round numbers. Back. There's Cam. Kyler, Sherman, Roquan Smith, and Alvin Kamara. And there's that guy, Jordan Love. This is who we're hunting for today. If you got them, list them. If you got them, list them. All right, well, nice hit there, MD Pietro, on the, uh, the Jitter Wills. You guys would be utterly surprised if you are unfamiliar with what, like, offensive linemen Hall of Fame cards go for for their rookies. Because they don't have a lot. Because they're uh, they're like you know they're not a very sexy uh, sexy pull. Tons. Go look at like Walter Jones or Orlando Pace like 1997 rookies like in good shape. They they sell for so much. Royals cards, what's going on? I think it's the first time I've seen your name pop up in the stream. I appreciate you checking it out. FSU Wags going with Jumbo. All right, um, Mr. Wagner, I need you to pick a box, box one or box two. Box one, all right. This is box one, and this pack was also from box one. So you can go ahead and take your pick. Uh, one through five on the left, and one through six on the right. Uh, Contenders does not have patch autos. Contenders has dual autos um, in the round number set. Um, and there's insert autos. All the insert uh, sets have autos, but no patch autos in Contenders. Same goes for Bowman, too, Hauser. Yeah, same, same in both. No patch autos. There was, um, Topps Chrome does it. They did it for, well, they did it for a couple of years when they existed, um, at the end, and then Optic put it in as a case hit. You know, these, uh, products that are traditionally not patch auto-oriented, that actually pretty much don't have any relic, relic material in hobby. Um, that's the only product that I can think of recently that's, that's done that, that's made that move is Optic, Optic Football. Tributes always had um, had patches and stuff like that. Um, probably not patch autos, but they have rare stuff. Like they have eye black autos, and um, they have like autographed pieces of like game used baseball. Um, there might be there might be some rare random set in tribute that is a patch auto, but tributes up uh, tributes pretty generic with the uh, the same stuff that it's always offered. FSU, it's your pick, buddy. Unless did I miss it? I'm sorry, I did. Uh, yeah, okay. I need you to pick a pick a pack. Left. All right, one through five. Left one, top one. All right. Good luck, buddy. Appreciate you checking out the stream. Can't believe we have to wait ten more minutes for the Jaguars to select Trevor Lawrence. Like, just get it over with. Like, have some respect for the people watching at home. Come on. All right. Crochet, Altuve, Alonzo, Machado, Garcia, Sanchez, Alvarez, Murphy, Lewis, Scherzer, Bryant, Santander, Dahlbeck, Pache, a futurist of Nick Gonzalez. Nice Torkelson. So we're back to the off-center 89s. We had one box that was off-center and one box that was fine. Joey Bart, top 100. Hunter Green, Austin Wells, Helio Ramos, J-Rod, Eddie Diaz, Bowman first, Chrome. Nick Allen, Forrest Whitley. Nice Austin Martin. 
Jose Salas, Torkelson, Volpe, Hose, Zamora, Bruhan, and Hunter Bishop. Just a touch to the left. Bit outside. Still blows my mind that that could happen in 2021. That some, some people can't figure out how to calibrate a, a cutting machine properly. Uh, but thank you for the purchase, Wags. And MDP is just going to go one more time for the contenders. All right. This is just, you can go one through nine this time. Feels like it sometimes, Hauser. Trevor Lawrence's head is kind of, kind of looks like a football. Anyone else feel that way? Okay, I'll pick. Go to. All right. Have you gotten anything good? Still waiting. Aren't we all? I've been uh, doing cards my whole life. I've still never had. I don't think I've ever pulled a card out of the pack that's been over a thousand dollars at the time. I've had a couple that have gone up in price. I'd really have to think about it and see if I've, I've ever done it. I don't think I have. The fact that I can't even remember what my biggest hit is tells you all you need to know. Prescott, Witten, Bridgewater, Jackson, and ha, kicker, Tyler Bass for the Bills. And a Roethlisberger MVP contender. I think Bass was the only kicker drafted. That's a good card. I'm pretty sure Bass was drafted. Maybe not. I thought he was. There was one kicker that got drafted. It was someone who was just a guy I've never heard of until... Uh, until I found out that it was a kicker that got drafted. A dumb sense for the night. Uh, Russell Wilson... Baker, Hopkins, Haskins, Devontae Adams, and Bo Jackson, legendary contenders. Bosa, Godwin, Sutton, Todd Gurley, Jalen Ramsey, and Barry Sanders. So we're, uh, we're, we're adhering to a strict one auto per round uh, rule here, it seems like. Uh, I don't know if the emails are posted on the app, Card Guru. But there you go. Right. Tonski. JF King, what's up? Alright, one through six this time. Uh, I do have Instagram, so I actually run three different Instagram accounts. Um, I have the one for my breaking stuff, which is Buffs Breaks, same same channel, uh, or same name as you see here. I have one for like my personal stuff, which is KL7 Cards, or Kyle Lowry 7 Cards. And then I uh, run the Blowout Cards 2 Instagram page as well. It's uh, the Instagram page for our eBay account. So those are all three. I, I manage all. You'll you'll tell right. You can tell right away because you'll see the uh, the pictures are all pretty much formatted the same way. So uh, Edelman, Rogers, Watt, Tre'Davious White, Josh Allen, and Michael Thomas MVP contenders. That Josh Allen is the other Josh Allen, by the way. It's not the quarterback Josh Allen. Rivers, Roethlisberger, Metcalf, Beckham. Daniel Jones and Okuda Chase Young round numbers. What's up, Maddie Boosh? Uh, I got a brand new box on the table. Um, we sold a one pack. We had a silver. I can tell you what it was. I can go look. We had a silver and a blue. I can't remember where they were. I think the silver was a rookie. Um, it was a Russian guy who 
was sitting on top of the the ring. He was like straddling the ring. That's all I remember. Watt, Juju, Sony Michelle, David Montgomery, Drew Brees, and a Kyler MVP contenders. Um, I would say, I would say do it, trust me. So that's kind of where we sit with that is uh, definitely no on-card auto out of this box, which is guaranteed one per box. But we did get points, so I, I couldn't tell you if that replaces the on-card auto. Um, And unfortunately, I, I really don't have much room on the product that I put it there. I, I try and price everything almost as low as I possibly I, uh, I possibly can, just to begin with. Um, I'd, I'd never really want to overcharge you guys for anything. Um, I want to give you guys the best price possible, right out the gates. You never have to ask me for it. So, all right, let's see. Let's see. Just huge Herbert, please and thank you. Good luck, buddy. Moore, Fitzpatrick, Matthew, Mac. All right, it's in here. We'll set it. We'll save it for the end. Cook, Hill, AJ Brown, Carryon Johnson, Wentz, and a Tua Rookie of the Year contenders. Also, haven't had, we haven't had no numbered autos out of this box either. Kelsey, Watson, Josh Allen, Preston Wilson, or Preston Williams, excuse me. Tyler Lockett, 87 of 99, championship ticket, and a Chase Young Rookie of the Year contenders. It's a Dick Butkus legendary contender. So, base auto. Good luck. Henry Ruggs. Not too shabby. Henry Ruggs. That is the regular, not the variation. So save the on card auto for the end. But we got a nice one. So nice rugs. Aaron Rodgers are saying is supposed to uh to go to the Raiders. It's Raiders and Broncos are the two teams linked to Aaron Rodgers. I do. I do have another box of contenders, so I'm going to add that into the store. That was one of the couple products I had a little bit uh, left of. new box of contenders into the store right now for you guys. Give me 
me one second. I gotta get my uh, computer charger. It died here and it's got all my pricing on it. So give me one second. I'll be right back. I go upstairs for one second to grab my computer charger, and all I see, all I hear, is. So, I go outside, and the boys in the hot tub with these three whore bags. <laughs> my wife's watching reruns of Jersey Shore. Ah, <laughs> oh, classic. Uh, my computer's gonna need like a solid uh, 30 seconds here to boot back up. Pretty sure it was $100 a uh, for the three pack lot of contenders, but I just wanna double check. Uh, contenders, where are you? Yeah, they're 100, okay. All right, so contenders are added back in. And uh, I did not miss anything. Um, this is a new box. This is a brand new box. No, no, I have... This is a brand new box. This and that pack. It's all the same box, Maddie. It's brand new. Someone already got one pack from it. Um, it was... Uh, I'll tell you what it was. Um, it was... Marab Vasilev or Balashvili. Marab Balashvili was the silver, and Jeff Neal was the blue. I apologize. I, I, I can't talk. I apologize if I explained that poorly the first time I said it. Um, but you've got six on the right and five on the left. Left four. All right, buddy. Good luck. Mr. Boosh. I think I saw another silver. Yep, so red silver this time. Alistar Overeem, Irene Aldana, Sadif Yusuf, or Sodiq Yusuf, rookie. Benil Darush, and a red. That's a nice one. Name I recognize from. Old school UFC, Ali Star Overeem. Well, not old school, but older school. It is 213 of 275. That's a nice one. That's got to be good, right? I would think so. Our silver is Edmund Shabazion. Nope. Shab Shabazan. Shabazan. Edmund Shabazan. I have to... Work it out phonetically. A lot of consonants that don't normally go together. Edmund Shabazan. <laughs> Who knows? I don't know. <laughs> the silver for him. Uh, Holly Holm, knockout artists. Alan Sterling, Figuardo, Renault, Buckley, rookie, and Felice Herrig. Thanks, Maddie. Did you grab something yesterday, Maddie? I can't remember. I just want to see if you had a uh, pile here. All right. uh, five and five this time. I don't think so. I didn't think so either. So I will trust both of our guts and say we'll make you a new pile. And if there is another one, I'll find it. <laughs> Ain't wrong there. For me, it's like just one like continuous like stream. Like I feel like I'm streaming when I'm asleep. All right, 
my jets. Let's just make sure real quick. There it is. All right, obvious. I do like the app. I even find myself just, you know, like randomly throughout the day when I'm at work, like just working on actual like projects, I just pop on and just see if anyone's breaking because I feel like I enjoy the uh, the people here a lot more than I. Um, I, mean, I can never watch like Breakers TV or anything like that. Some of the uh, I just don't find them very like pleasant to listen to. A lot of the people there. Um, hit a color blast, please. Okay, I didn't look yet. Leon Edwards, Jimmy Rivera, Rose. Nama Yunus, Chris Weidman. Didn't he win? Wasn't he like a, a champion for a while? Pretty sure he was. Alexander Pantoya, a red rookie of Kevin Holland, kicking someone right in the grill. Silver, there it is. The Holland is 52 of 275, but hey, buddy. Bam! Uh! I think this one we all know. Good hit. Nice job. Uh, it's a little bit off right to left. Top to bottom is good. Right right to left you're about 60-40. Maybe 65-35. Um, but it's pretty good. It's close. It's close to 10 centering. It's right on the cusp. I, I Personally, I feel like this is 9 centering. Um, but it's close. Uh, Volkanovski, Fearless, Shevchenko, Sanchez, Carlos Sparza, and Alex Caceres. Nice hit, buddy. Well, McGregor. So two good silver prisms. I think the two silver prisms are best hit today. McGregor Silver and uh, Herbert Silver. Wow, that is something else. Four twenty, crazy. Turt dog, what's up, brother? I mean, that's a good card. And people come in here always asking, are the autos pulled? Are the autos pulled? Who needs autos? <laughs> Who needs autos? When you've got the easiest to pull uh, parallel, it's going to sell for like 25 different autos combined. Oh. <sighs> Uh, this is this is the pick that uh is gonna make things interesting here. The Niners pick. It's so hard to watch the draft with no sound, but I don't wanna violate any uh any copyright rules. I don't want to get anyone from loop in trouble here by having the uh, the sound on. Can you imagine if they just go out of left field and just, just take Pitts? What a team that would be with Kittle, Pitts, Ayuk, Debo Samuel, Mostert, Jeff Wilson Jr. My God, loaded. And then the defensive line, loaded. Mod Mouse, what's going on? I mean... Garoppolo is not like a incompetent quarterback. He's not losing them games. He's not like a game changer. But he's a game manager. But I mean, if you have if, that, would be a trove of weapons. Trove of weapons. I hear what you're saying, Hauser, but you know, every year we'll we'll say this about a lot of guys, and they wind up not winning games. We think that they'll win us games, but usually, I mean, if you look statistically, like through the years, generally speaking, about only about 15% of first-round quarterbacks really wind up making a career. 
at a, like a, a good, solid career for themselves. And most of them are in that game manager category. Very few of them actually wind up hitting. And every year, there's four, five, six of them that we're talking about like this. And it winds up being one, maybe two. So it's it's funny because you actually have to sit and think about it and look at it, and you go back through the years, and you're like, wow, wow, wow. And before you know it, you're down to like maybe 15, maybe 20 percent of guys. You know, a lot of them flame out two or three years or wind up as you know good backups. Which is nothing to sneeze at. I mean, it's like it's probably the most competitive position in the world and the hardest position in the world, at least in sports, to play competently. Like, think about it. You can't even find 30 guys that can play the position competently. So. Mr. Coppola, did you uh, did you happen to get my email, buddy? I know you said you sent one last night. I didn't I didn't see it anywhere in my inboxes. Um, so I, I went ahead and sent you one based off the uh, the information that uh, is on file for you. No, you're all good. I just wanted to let you know I actually went ahead and sent it out already for you today. So um, I already I already shipped it. So if you can if you want to check it and uh, take care of it, that's great. I would appreciate it, but they're already on their way to you. So it was only a couple bucks. I think it was eight dollars it cost to uh, to get a priority mail to you. So, all right, we're all gonna pause for a second. I want to see the pick here. No problem, buddy. The uh, the PayPal info is in the the email I sent. So. Yeah, if anyone, uh, my mouse, if anyone doesn't want me to send, like, the veteran base or, like, the no-name just has no chance of ever being worth anything stuff, I will always do that for you. It uh, makes my life easier. Um, all you got to do is just request it, and I'll mark it down when I'm making your stack of cards that you do not want, uh, you know, your Joe Alexander third year 2011 base cards or whatever they might be. Master Wu, DK, just make the pick so we can see what's going to happen with this draft. Uh, we opened two, two. Someone bought one set of two packs. Um, there was an eighty-five Devers in there. Was the only notable, only notable one today, from the the couple packs. So I. Uh, I think I don't even know if we've we've hit a good rookie. You know, we did we hit a Trent Grisham rookie? I think Grisham maybe would be the only um, big rookie that we hit. I can't even remember if we hit him or not. Uh, I think there's. I'll check in one second here. I just want to see this one pick. I'm sorry. There it is. He said it. Trey Lance said it. Uh, I do do eBay consignment, Maddie. Um, I can list it for you. I can't do it today, but I can do it tomorrow. I can put up five day five day auction. That does shake it up. Where's Mac Jones gonna go now? Mac Jones is probably uh pooping his pants a little bit. But Maddie, here's my email. Uh yeah, I don't even know. Do they have messages on here? Do they even have a messaging system on the, this app? I honestly don't know. Okay, cool. I didn't think so. Here, here's my email. Spot on, Hauser. Spot on. Just go ahead and uh, send it over there. And if um, let me know when you send it over. Because if I don't have anyone in the queue, I can just respond to you uh, real quick while we're we're waiting here. Mac, I didn't like Mac Jones. <laughs> I I was shocked when all the Mac Jones talk just showed up out of nowhere. Um, I just remember Lance's year two years ago, the whatever it was, the one interception and uh, five million touchdowns. 
I mean, he was playing chess. Oh, the league has been going away from Mac Jones for a long time, and it's funny that you said that because they were talking on the radio this morning about uh, how Mac Jones would be a good fit in uh, San Francisco because Kyle Shanahan likes to run the bootleg. And then, like, literally the first thing that... The, the only thing that they put up on the screen when they had Mac Jones up before was, like, limited mobility. I was like, they <laughs> they just said the... Like, how can two people say... So, like, that's not, like, something that's up for debate either. You're mobile or you're not. Like, how could you be that far, like, that far off on something like that? Bizarre, but... There's the quidge. What's up, Mike? DK? Sorry, guys. Okay. I heard a ding. A couple dings. Um, Maddie, I just saw your email. I will get back to you in two seconds. Let me just do these couple, uh, couple things here. Justice, I don't know the answer to that. Oh, Dirt Dog's doing it. Oh, boy. All right. Well, Maddie's got to pack a prism. first and then we're gonna have a fun little football night here so maddie four left five right right two all right good luck ed herman randy costa rookie Marina Rodriguez, Joe Lozon, Volkan Ozdemir, a purple, rookie, Brad Rydell, or Rodell, not sure. That is going to be 93 of 149, and wow, you are just on fire today, buddy. McGregor, knockout artist this time, silver. Just another McGregor Silver. Um, if you want me to do it, I would say do them individually. You don't want to take away from uh, someone who only wants the, the, the base or the only wants the insert. Usually lots are not the way to go. Uh, and it's it's not like it's like a lot of work to list one extra card. So <laughs> I would recommend, personally, you can do whatever you want. They're your cards. I would recommend against. I always recommend against it. Uh, Amanda Nunez, Fireworks. Chaos Williams rookie, Cub Swanson, Mickey Gall, and, wow, that was weird, and Mickey Gall. Two McGregor Silvers, back-to-back -back packs, crazy. Well, I guess they said, we're going to give you two McGregor Silvers, we're gonna also going to give you two Mickey Galls to, to cancel it out. All right, Jerry, hold on one second here, and then we'll get you rolling with uh, the big one.
right, Maddie. You're getting uh, emailed back right now. You have all the ins uh, info there, Matt. Okay. Dirt Dog. Oh, where is it? It's up here, isn't it? Okay, buddy. Yeah, box price on NT came down a little bit. So these are the last two from the case that you've been um, playing with. So, we'll actually go, we'll go front or back. Uh, this is the product. A couple of front, okay. So this is the product. Like this is, if you hit, if you hit the Herbert from this, you, you can go on vacation. If you hit the, the one of one Herbert from this, you can buy a house. This is the one. This is it. The bee's knees. Uh, yes. When you're, well, for certain things, um, if uh, it depends on what you're looking for. For rookies, for the rookie rookie patch autos, this is the most exp this will be the most expensive Justin Herbert card on the planet. If the flaw or the NT true one of one rookie patch auto, so oh nice Herbert book, sweet. All right, dirt dog. And then after this, I think Kami's back. I didn't see what he grabbed. I just saw it ding. I saw his name. Um, Good luck, buddy. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. They took pits at four. Okay, I see it up there now, actually, in the back. Pretty obvious pits at four. They do make it for baseball, but Panini doesn't have the baseball license, so it doesn't sell for nearly as much. Um... For baseball, the Bo the it's this product. This will be the most expensive card for anyone if it exists. Is the Bowman Chrome uh, Super Fracker Rookie Auto. So, but they do make this for baseball. It's actually a really good product. But again, uh, people some people don't like it because no licenses. But I'm a fan of it. I think it's kind of a good value because uh, because of that. So let's get the decoy here to hide the back cards. All right, here it is. I can look and see if we have it. I gotta look and see what the price is. Um, if the price doesn't make sense to me, I'm not gonna grab it, but if it does, I will. As long as the internet's working tomorrow, obviously, because that really, uh, <laughs> really was not pleasant today, having no internet at work. Makes it difficult to do that, uh, that W word that I just said. Was it work? Yeah. All right, good luck, buddy. Tailgater, AO. Guy loves chicken, tailgater. Chicken and beer. Starting off with Aaron Rodgers, 33 or 35, on his way out the door in Green Bay. He's not looking for a receiver. He's looking for a new home. Moving on to... That's kind of cool. First time we've seen this, uh, this set. Super Bowl Immortality, Brett Favre, Super Bowl 31. Is that actually unnumbered? That can't be. An unnumbered National Treasures card. Never seen it in my life. But again, this is the uh, first time first time I've ever seen this set. So definitely new, but cool. I'm assuming it's got to be short printed. Like, got to be short printed short if it's not serial numbered. There's never been an unnumbered National Treasures card in the history of National Treasures. The entire print run going back to 2006. So this is interesting. 
Maybe someone, uh, someone in the chat can shed a little light on what we got there. I think Century Materials, correct. Matthew Stafford, 42 of 99. What's up, Kitwe? Back at it. DJ Chark, Colossal, just missed the jersey number. That is 16 of 99. Lamar, Jersey, 76 of 99, Franchise Treasures. All right, now we're getting into the good stuff. Got a patch here, correct. DK Metcalf, so it's a two-color, but it's technically kind of a one-color because uh, it's that, that two-tone gray that's on the inside of the numbers for the Seahawks patches. Again, missed the Jersey by one, 15 of 49. So... The two color, one color patch there. And finally getting to our autos. <laughs> Speaking of the NFL drafts, my favorite combine moment ever, Chris Jones. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go look up Chris Jones' 40. <laughs> Great football player, too, uh, by the way. But funniest thing, I watched that video maybe 5 million times, I think. I think I'm going to take a quick peek and see. Eh, I can't tell. I thought this might have been an RPA, but. <laughs> All right. Nope. It's not. It is. Okay. Say, I thought it was. It's the Cole Komet jersey number emerald RPA. 57 of 85 for the Bears. I thought it was an RPA, but. Plate. Who is that? I'm doing Seahawks 80. Is that Josh Gordon? Oh, Greg Olson. Yeah, I'm not too stoked about Cole Komet. A uh, decent player, but not too stoked. One of one, Greg Olson. Cyan plate. I'll tell you what, though. Curse all you want about Cole Komet. Because we got that guy. NFL gear, not the RPA, but I'll take it. And once again, one off the jersey number. 11 of 99. Good card. Good card. That's how NT does. It's a roller coaster. It's like, oh, Cole Komet. Ah, oh, we're dying. Oh, Justin Herbert. <laughs> Let me see if I got a mag for that one. I normally don't mag stuff at all, but um, let's see if I can find one. Hey, Butters. Fooj. That'll do. So nice box, buddy. Congrats on that. I wish it was the RPA for you, or if it was just jersey numbered, but... I think we got a couple items here in the queue, too, that I gotta get to, so I apologize for going slow on that one. You're welcome, buddy. You deserved it. Definitely deserved it. I mean, that was just... You've gotten all three boxes that I've sold so far, so... Happy that you got it. Um, all right. Kami's going to do 1920, the Optic Retail Lot. Oh. So I only have one in the store. I think I listed that incorrectly. Um, let me just... Take a look here. I just want to make sure that I didn't like screw up and click the wrong item or something here. This is what that should have been. I just want to make sure that that's what it was. There should have been two of them. 
Piper, Pink Piper, yeah. Okay, I think I just, uh, yeah, I definitely just uh, missed the changing the quantity. Uh, yeah, I can add the other two in for you right now. Just hold on one second. There should have been four there. The other, the other one should have been there to begin with. I just missed it. So hold on one second. Let me add them in. So no one buy these when they go in. These are for Kami. And I gave you a little bit of a discount, buddy. Feel bad about the uh, the, the Herbert Silver Tua debacle. Or a uh, Burrow pack, excuse me. So I gave you a little bit of a discount on this one. You're welcome. It's, I mean, it's the most I can do. I wish I could do more, but... I'm sure every little bit helps, right? All right, so I'm going to do all four of these for Kami, and then I know there was another purchase in between his two, but let me just knock these out real quick. Good luck, brother. Starting off with the Tim Hardaway Jr., and that's nice. Hell yeah. Winner stays. Hollow. Kobe. Boom. Good card. Pretty sure PSA 10s of this card are about 100 bucks. That's a sharp one. Real sharp. Donovan Mitchell, My House, and Goga. Got another hollow coming out. I think it's another Winner Stays hollow. Mitchell Robinson, Montrez Harrell, and this time it's a purple Kawhi. All right. One of my favorite sets uh, in in this one. Seti Osman in Optic Retail. I think that might be my favorite, uh, favorite of the retail inserts. I don't know why. I just like it. This is my least favorite one coming up. Bogdanovich, Ben Simmons, and not a fan of this. Too busy. Card design way too busy for me. Express Lane, Kemba Walker, and Grant Williams. And the last one. Holiday, Danny Green, Kawhi Leonard Splash, and Jaron Jackson. So, awesome Kobe, for sure. Add it to your pile, buddy. You're very welcome, my friend. All right, we got a couple items now. Up, oh, low power mode. Let me get my charger. Be right back. Forty-five seconds. Actually, I'm gonna go pee too. So I'm gonna give me a give me a, a full minute here.
All right, guys, yeah, sorry about that. Uh, phone charger. Okay. Okay. And let me just, I got to move the camera here, so. underneath so I don't knock anything over all right we are now good to go I'm always feeling lucky if I'm feeling unlucky you'll know about it trust me all right let me take a look I don't know where we are yet uh, in the queue okay so we did con we did all that where are we here okay Mr. Coppola going with Ben Baller. All right. Um, I mean, the, the thing that you really want is an auto. They're one in ten boxes, so don't hold your breath. Um, but other than that, uh, you want the die cut. And you want, I mean, any of the good base rookies. Um, and then numbered cards. So you're kind of hunting for a bunch of different stuff. Auto is the uh, the big one. Uh, super Fractors, too. They're actually pretty easy to hit. And the Super Fractors are only one in, like... I think maybe like 15 boxes or 20 boxes. So, all right, give them the goods. Do that one and, eh, that one feels okay. Yeah, yeah, I already put down. Let's go with that one. I don't know what I was even debating between, but. All right, let's get it. For Mr. Coppola. Matt Olson, Brock Burke rookie. Logan Webb rookie, Rowdy Tellez. Should have went with the other one. <laughs> A nice Mookie. Glaber. There you go. That's one of the big rookies. Bichette. And the great thing about this set is very, very easy to grade. Like, super easy to grade. The card's dead centered. Uh, so that is beautiful. And Kyle Schwarber. So this is definitely your winner in uh, those two packs. wasn't the greatest packs in the world, but Bichette is very nice. Uh, I think last time I checked, it's like a, it was like 20, 20 to thirty bucks for all somewhere in that range. I know I sold mine for twenty two uh, about a month and a half ago. So one of my extras. But that's just raw. Um, like I said, graded that card uh, definitely covers covers your packs. No problem, buddy. And bets is a couple bucks too, probably. So that's the other good thing I like about this product. I was saying, like, base cards definitely sellable, which uh, I'm a fan. I was looking for your stack. There isn't one because I shipped it. Da -da -da. Nice job, Buff. Uh, that card, yeah, I definitely would. Uh, I'd, I'd say usually, like at this point, ten dollars, ten to fifteen dollars is about my threshold. Not if it costs three hundred. No, um, I would be using the value service, which is the cheapest one that they would offer. Which is, you know, you'd, you'd be a around twenty dollars give or take a little bit depending on uh i don't know what the pricing is going to be when they come back if it's going to be higher or lower if they're going to change everything who knows what they're going to do but it'll take a while to get it back all right we are on to t jimmy for ufc I'll teach you me uh, one through four, one through four. I pick. All right, we'll go bottom right here. Good luck, bud. Sorry guys, give me one second here. Okay. T Jimmy. Let 
UFC prison. Blow out cards in the house. Okay, got a couple colors that we don't normally see. An orange and a lime green. I think they were 75 and 49. Can't remember. Right? Good luck, though. Holly Holm, Jeff Neal, Cody Stammen, Max Holloway, lime green of Jakare Souza. We'll check the serial number in just a minute. And the orange is a rookie of mm, who? Giga Chikadze. Chikazi? Giga Chikaze? Chikadze? It's kind of like Goga Patadze, but Chikadze. Instead of Goga, it's Giga. Maybe they're twins. But the Souza is 60 of 75, and I think the orange should be to 49. Orange is 40, or 99, okay. 73 of 99 on the Chikadze. And then we got a Bones Jones instant, uh, instant impact. Luke Rockhold, Jimmy Crute rookie. Roxanne Modafferi, Jermaine De Randami, and Kamara Usman. Sorry if I'm crushing those names just very poorly. I... <laughs> Yeah, I'm doing my best. Uh, Mark, just so you know, I saw your email. Um, I already let um, let them know that you. I only opened one pack for you. So if you did get charged twice, they should be able to take care of it for you. So you should be A-OK. -okay. I already confirmed that. You, I saw one purchase. We opened one pack. If you got charged twice, should be a, they should be able to help you out. Yeah, I, I'm trying. No problem, buddy. Mark, and thank you for the purchase, T. Jimmy. UFC is... I'll never get better at UFC either because I, I rarely, rarely watch it. So unless... Unless you guys are willing to, like, phonetically spell out the proper way to do it, uh, you're just going to have to roll with what I say. And the, the funny thing is, the last time I let someone do that for me, they told me how to pronounce someone's name completely wrong, and I was saying it wrong for months. Ooh, I like this. JWT Artifacts Hockey. Now, these are names I know how to say. Oh, it's definitely fun to watch. It's enjoyable. It just comes on way too late for me. I'm usually... If I'm not streaming, I'm asleep. So, I mean... At that point in time. Uh, with the exception of some of the big pay-per-view ones. Um, but pick two. Pick two, JWT. I am East Coast. Yeah. Two and five, all right. Uh, I think you're next, JT. JTC. Oh, I'm sorry, I missed you. So I will do you next. I'm sorry, I totally totally skipped you there. My my other camera got in the way of my uh, my screen. So you will be next. I apologize though about that. So yeah, everything starts late here for uh, for us. It's like the East Coast problem for sports, but I can't really complain. All right. Vezina winner, Connor Hellebuk. Martin Caught. It's funny, we hit his uh, we hit his green out of one of the other packs from this box to 99. So now there's the, four, or the uh, 999. Phil Kessel and Darcy Kemper. Man, if Darcy Kemper could stay healthy, it would have really helped my fantasy team this year. Parise, and an auto. Look at that. Rasmus Asplund, autofax for the Sabres. Those are unnumbered. Keith Yandel, and Pekka Rene. So I think the uh, I, hot tip, the whatever the better hits are, so the Rookie Redemption and the Patch Card are both still out there in, uh, in artifacts. Definitely still out there. If there are any hockey fans in the room. Or it might be in a room instead of a patch card, but it was uh we've had the Asplund and there's a dual jersey of a no name rookie so far. All right, JTC. Again, sorry about that. I didn't mean to skip you. If I ever do that, just tell me I'm being an idiot and that you demand to go to the top of the list right now. I know. I just you know, I like to make fun, uh, make fun of myself when I screw up. It's like my coping mechanism. Because I insult myself out loud. <laughs> All right. Um, 
It was 18 heritage high. Cool. All right, 18 heritage high. Let's find the Acuna, or the Acunas. No Acuna yet out of this entire box. All right, I would love to pull you two Acunas. Just pick your numbers. One through four, left and right. I don't think we've hit the action or color anything as well. That should still be in here, if my memory serves correct. Okay. I'm assuming you want two left and I'm gonna pick another number for the right here. Okay. Yeah, I think the only we hit a black border of I think it was Joey Lucchesi maybe. We did hit the uh, the relic, which was a good card. It was a dual relic, and then we had a Soto base, an Atani base, Torres base. But I don't think we've had a color swap or an action variation or. Anything. We hit one chrome, a base chrome of, I think it was Todd Frazier. I think. I might be confusing boxes, but we should still have some goodies left here in the rest of this box. So, good luck. Dyson, there it is. Took all of two cards. Something about twos. Pack two, pack two, card two. Ronnie. There we go. Check that off the list. Congratulations. Luke Roy, Tyler Clippard, the trifecta of home runs now and then. It's Manny Machado. And Mark Bellinger, or Belanger, Belanger, don't know. Probably not French. He's a baseball player from 1969. Uh, CJ Cron, Tio Scar Fernandez, Trace Thompson, and Richie Blyler. Yay! <laughs> Actually, going to be a pain, pain in the butt tonight. PJ Conlon, Ryan Flaherty, Sal Romano, Brandon Drury, and a Stephen Piscotti short print. Breakout Braves, Freeman and Acuna. I said I was going to pull you two Acunas. Did I not? I done did, and then I done did it. Just an insert, but hey, sign me up. Moreland. Ross and Jamie Barria. I'll throw the other Acuna in a sleeve too, because I mean it's Ronald Acuna, right? Love it. You're like a large, a Cold Stone Creamery. Love it. Bad joke. All right. Uh, did you have a pile from yesterday, JTC? I cannot remember. All right, all right, all right. I got some props. I don't think he did. Uh, okay. All right. We're gonna be on CMD next. Let's get JT's stack set up. Okay. All right, so now we're on to CMD with 2020 Chrome Sapphire. Nice. Uh, it's going to be one through four on the regular Sapphire. Okay, let's see what we got here. Ugh. Good luck. That's a good one on top. Judge. Tyler Alexander. He's actually uh, in the majors and pitching halfway decently. So not, not the worst rookie you can get. I think I get them all confused, all the Tylers. Tyler Anderson and Tyler Alexander. I can't remember which is which. I think Tyler Alexander is still on the Tigers, and Tyler Anderson is on uh, the Pirates, I think. But Christian Yelich, solid. I mean, they're three pretty solid base. And Matt Beattie. So not too shabby. I mean, you can do way worse out of a pack of uh, Sapphire there than the reigning MVP 
uh, home run champ and a rookie who's still in the league and pitching fairly decently. At least the last time I checked a couple of days ago. Thanks, buddy. Thank you, sir. You are very welcome. All right, Maddie's going to do another UFC, and then JWT's going to do some more artifacts. I no, literally, can I knock over anything else? <laughs> All right. <laughs> One through seven on uh, UFC. Five, okay. This is just obviously going to have a McGregor Silverado, right? How about just a gold, though, instead? Natty, hot, gold. We'll save it to the end. Joaquin Buckley, Felice Herrig, Cody Garbrandt, uh, Diego Ferreira, and Alexander Gustafson. Some names that I know. A couple of them in there, that actually, that I recognized. Volkanovsky. I'm just going to go with Zagat. Or is that Zabit? I'm not even going to try that one. Uh, Augusto Sakai, Kaylin Chukigan, Red of Rob Font. I forget which way this gold is going. Okay, the gold is this way. Good luck. Gold one time. I think it's an insert. That's nice. Uh, your insert is Jorge Masvidal. Knockout artist, uh, artist of TJ Dillashaw. That's like an understatement. Diminuendo. Dillashaw, 10 of 10. Another name that I I remember. So Dillashaw Gold. Let's throw that in a sleeve for you. And then the font red is 163 of 275. And this Prism Hobby Box is just destroying our last one. I mean, the last one we had two red autos to 49, which weren't too bad. But which one? No, no, that's just the basic insert. It's nothing. The inserts are uh, one per pack. Why, is he good? Is he someone special? I don't recognize him. Okay. Cool. Yeah, not number. That's just the basic insert for that one. Yeah, they have they have parallels of all the insert sets. So they exist definitely, hundred percent. That was that was just the base one, unfortunately. All right, JWT back at it with artifacts. One, two, three, four. Pick two. Give me two hit, uh, two hits left in here. Two and three. All right. Good luck. God, they package these so poorly. Like, this is the second one. There was a card in the other pack that had the corner, same thing, like crimped, because it's... They use these giant decoys, so you can't tell where the hits are, which is good. That's a good thing. But I don't like it when it damages the base cards. But here's one of our hits. Oh, nice. Tundra Teammates Quads. Timo Meyer, Evander Kane, Mark Edward Vlasic, and Martin Jones for the Sharks. I don't think that's going to be numbered, but... Oh, it is numbered. Look at that. Shocked me. 9 of 99. No patch in this box. But quad jersey instead. And Jake Gensel. And our last pack. Mira Heiskanen. Very good young defenseman for the Stars. And Eric Carlson. 93 of 299. Looks like a green parallel for the Sharks. Seth Jones and Ryan Getzlaff. Hitseeker, Willie, Dunk, Pedro, Jakey. A lot of homies. What's going on? You're very welcome, dude. Nice hit on the Sharks quad.
think that catches us up on the queue as of right now. Uh, yeah, I got a free second right now. As soon as I say that and get away, ding! Here's the uh, the base, Ronnie. So good looking card. No problem, buddy. Congratulations again. Two packs, two Acunas. All right, Maddie's gonna keep rolling with Prism. This Prism is smoking hot. All right, didn't knock anything over that time. All right, last one, Color Blast. Number three. Uh, Nick, we the best card from the case, we just hit it. Um, we hit a Herbert uh, NFL gear, jersey, football, uh, on card auto to 99. The other best hits from the case was a Chase Claypool one-of-one one redemption from the field pass set. And a LaDainian Tomlinson one-of-one one patch auto printing plate. Um... That's what stands out to me that I can remember. So, all right, here you go, Maddie. Let's see if we can get you on this one. How about an auto? Maddie's just crushing this box. All right, Dominic Cruz, Demir is Magalov, Yuri Prochaska, Ryan Span, Claudia Gadella, Blue of Cron Gracie. We'll save the auto for a second here. It's a fireworks of. Davison, Figuierdo, uh, Ankalev, that's not right. Yeah, maybe it is. Ankalev, rookie. Uh, Joanna Jedracek. Uh, Khabib's brother, <laughs> rookie, and Michael Chandler. All right, let's see what we got for an auto. Looks like it's going to be a base auto this time. Octagon signatures of Boss Rutin. Not familiar? Maybe good, maybe not. Guess not. <laughs> I have no idea. Boss Rutin. It looks like. Yeah, well. The picture on the back kind of makes it look like it's an old photo. So it might be an older guy. I don't know. That doesn't look like a, like a, a new photo. Yeah. So that answers the question. That's kind of what I figured. Uh, question is though, is he good? I've never heard of him. Thank you for that, Butters. I appreciate the uh, the info there. And Gracie is seven of one ninety nine. All right. Isn't that a song? The Here Comes the Boom? Like, uh, System of a Down? That's what I know that saying from. Oh, okay. I haven't seen that whole movie. I've seen parts of it, though. I like Kevin James. He kind of, so cool. He's like that guy that like some people don't think he's funny at all. He cracks me up. All right, JW. Finishing off the artifacts. Of our rookie redemption in one of these packs. Being a pain in the ass to open, though. All right. We got my man, Mika. Um, my the, my real man here, Hank, for three ninety nine, that two hundred eight or three ninety nine. Nick Schmaltz and Sam Reiner. I feel like we've got an unhealthy amount of Phoenix Coyotes and San Jose Sharks in this box. And last pack's gonna be our rookie redemption. I'll save it for the end here. Tyler Bertuzzi, Philip Grubauer, Victor Olofsson, and artifacts. Blue Jackets. I don't think they've announced the Blue Jackets. Or I don't think they've announced these yet, have they? The, uh, the Artifacts Rookie Redemptions? Have they announced them yet? 
They do suck to open these the artifacts. I don't recall seeing the list. I'm trying to think who would be Columbus. Is there anyone I can think of off the top of my head that would be Columbus? Well, no one that was on my fantasy radar, that's for sure. We'll take a two-second ponder onto the internet. See if they announced it. Oh, we got... We do. We do have an announcement here. Okay. Oh, let me see the card number. I can find it. 189. Whoop, it is. Matisse. Kivlinix. Kivlinix. Matisse Kivlinix. Not a name I'm familiar with, so one more Google. He is Latvian, 24. Goalie. Oh. Uh, didn't play this year. Played six games last year to the tune of a 295 goals against and a just under 900 save percentage. Uh, this year in the AHL, he's got 227 goals against and a 926 save percentage, but only in a couple games. So that is Matisse Kivlinix. You're welcome, buddy. Thanks for the purchases. All right. Diminuendo is going to do Prism Hobby. Ufsa. All right, one through five. One through five on these. Three, okay, there we go. Let's see what we got here. It's been a great box so far. It's like an orange and a red, so it should be a 275 and a 99. There's Giga Chikadze again, Muslim Salikov, Angela Hill, Jared Cannonier, and Raquel Pennington is our red. Orange, Jose Aldo, that's got to be a good one. 262 of 275. This is a great box. A lot of names that I recognize, and obviously the McGregors, but Aldo, orange to 99, 39 of 99. Like, what's the equivalent of a UFC jersey number? Is it like chest size? Like your inseam or something? <laughs> uh, Alexander Volkanovsky, impact. Brendan Allen, rookie. Lauren Murphy. Vivian Arroyo. Rodolfo Vieira, rookie. And Rafael Dos Anjos. So, solid all, though. This, this box is just continuing to give. So, so designed. Bowman Jumbo. All right. All right, so so I need you to pick uh, which box you would like to pull from, box one or box two. Both boxes have um, ten packs left. Box two, all right. So go ahead and take your pick. Left, right, one through five. Oops. Right three, all right. Good luck. Darvish, Scooble, Schmidt, McKenzie, Ian Anderson, Madrigal, Garrett Crochet, DV Garcia, Jay Cronenworth, and Luis Campusano. Uh, all rookies there for the like six in a row. Acuna, Bieber, Yelich, Murphy. Futurist of Blaze Jordan, 
So nice Jordan there. Joey Bart, rookie card logo in the 89 Bowman set. Jordan Balzovich, top 100. Miguel Amaya, Forrest Whitley, Torkelson, Yusnel Diaz, Carson Tucker. Corbin Carroll, Xavier Edwards, Bryce Jarvis, Bo Naylor, Brennan Davis, Logan Davis, and Tristan Cassis, Seth Beer, Alec Thomas, and Wander Franco is going to do it for that pack. So a nice Jordan insert. We didn't see much of Austin Martin yet today. I feel like we've seen Jordan a bunch uh, all over the base cards and chromes and stuff. Alright. Thank you for the purchase, So-So. E Double's going to do another one from this super hot box of UFC Prism. All right, you can go one through four. You're welcome, buddy. Uh, there's one auto gone in each in each box so far, so so. So we're uh, pretty much right on right on pace where we should be. Mathematically speaking, maybe a little ahead of pace as far as hitting autos. Uh, they were all they were both no name players so far. What's up, Justin? Well, not no names, but they weren't anything special. It was Yolmar Sanchez and um, a guy from the A's that started with a B. Chilling, man. E double, take your pick here, one through four. Just hanging out, you know. Bottom pack. Embarrassing myself trying to pronounce these fighters' names. Oh, did the Eagles move up to 10? The Cowboys must have traded it. Yeah, okay. Sorry, one second. E-double. A lot going on here in the NFC East, which is my division. Who'd they take? Oh, wow, they took... Whoa! They moved up to take Devonta Smith. Wow, wow, wow. They were saying he was going to slide down to, like, the Redskins at, like, 19 or wherever they're picking. All right. Silver and purple. Marab... Vashlishvili, Juliana Pena, Tesha Torres, Sean O'Malley, and our purple. Another good one, Glover Teixeira. And, well, that's another good one. This box is hot. Khabib, silver. It's a crazy good box. The Teixeira is 92 of 149. I mean, the Eagles need a lot of things, but, I mean, they haven't had a relevant wide receiver in... <sighs> I mean, Alshon Jeffries is the closest thing they've had since Deshaun Jackson, one of the 15 times he was an Eagle and then not an Eagle. TJ Dillashaw, knockout artist. Uh, Darren Elkins, Brad Tavares, uh, Khabib Bass, Edmund Shabazian, and Robbie Lawler. No. Prison Fast Break Basketball? Oh, I don't think so. I think the variation's gone. I think the variation's gone, but that's it. No problem, E-Double. And, uh, I don't... I... Give me a second, Justin. Let me check, because I don't know... Uh, I don't think I put the whole box out. Maybe I did on the in the chat, so give me half a second, I will let you know here. I might have, like, a few more packs left over sitting here in my backup stash. Um, I do. So, there's six. So, there's six packs over there, plus whatever's left in the store, which is... Now 11. So after after the pack that you bought, there's 11 packs left. No, you have to go through and get them. Click each one individually, unfortunately. Um, I wish there was a way that you could do that to change the quantity. I think they said they're actually working on that. So, but um, You can go ahead and... Were you going to grab all of them, or do you want to just go one at a time? It's up to you. I don't care. 
Uh, I just was going to do Soso's Bowman pack if you're going through trying to purchase them uh, one at a time. Okay, that probably answers my question. So I'm going to let Justin do that, and then Soso, we can do your Bowman pack while Justin's going through and grabbing the uh, the fast breaks. Uh, did you want to go out of box one or box two? Box two, okay. So. Here you go, buddy. Take your pick. Five left, four right. Top right, okay. Good luck. All right, Judge, Yastrzemski, Bichette, Bauer, Soler, Sanchez, Kirilov, Christian Javier, Braylon Marquez, Otani, Blackman, Brian Anderson, Harper, and Yadi Molina. Max Meyer, Futurist, a Riley Green, Positional Promise, a Luis Robert, Bowman Scouts, Top 100, Number 3. I'm a prospect, but I'm no longer a rookie card logo because that was last year player. Just the weirdest, weirdest times here for Bowman. Uh, Ed Howard. Riley Green, Logan Gilbert, Leo Verpaguero. Uh, this is his Bowman first. Uh, even though it doesn't have the logo, they forgot to put it on the card. So that's a decent one. And Brendan Shoemake, Atomic, Tuper Box. Solid card. And another guy who's playing well, Nick Maton. Valade, Alex Ramirez, Austin Wells, Helio Ramos, Nick Gonzalez, Carson Tucker, Emerson Hancock, Cade Cavalli, and Christopher Morrill. It's going to do it for that pack of jumps. You're welcome. You're very welcome, sir. Tailgater back in the house. I boss. All right. Uh, let me see, Justin. Did you grab all of them here? You got one, two, three, four. I think you got five so far. Five, yeah. <laughs> uh, it should be in there. Yeah, I, I don't know if there's a way to search. I don't think there is. You just have to kind of scroll. There it goes. Oh, nope, JTC. <laughs> uh, let me see if I can find it for you. There it is. Um, so it's towards the top of basketball. There's a whole bunch of uh, 18, 19 Chronicles and then 19, 20 Chronicles. It's a little, it's like right underneath that. It's two or three down underneath that. Under the Chronicles fat packs. Uh, JTC. Do yours for you. Go ahead and pick one through six. Grab two. And then we'll do Justin's six packs of uh, Fast Break. Three, five. All right. All right. Good luck. Let's see if we can find a color swap or an action or something. What did the Giants do? Oh, we traded back. I mean, they're, they got to be taking a quarterback, right? The Bears here. The Bears fans are just losing their minds. Rojas, Brian Johnson, Gift Nagopi, Matt Caesar, and Randall Gritchick should be a short print. It is. Eduardo Nunez, Pedro Severino, Tony Sangrani, and Mark Tana. Logan Forsythe, Daniel Palka, Anthony Santander rookie, Lance Lynn, and a Robinson Cano award winners. Scott Kingray rookie, Nick Ahmed, Chase Utley, and Mirandi Gonzalez. First, uh, the Acuna packs were a little bit better than that one. They have the Giant. Oh, they got the Bears first next year? Oh, my God. Oh, let's go. This is the first time Gettleman has ever traded back, ever. Oh, Roger Goodell's like reading like a speech. Oh. Okay. Wow. They got wow, wow, wow. All right, Justin. Do you want to just do the six that I have on the table, or do you want me to grab the other six that I have over there, and you want to just pick and choose? Uh, everything should be in here. They're all from the same box. 
Yeah. Uh, there's no way I would pass up a first next year. I mean, the Bears could stink. This could actually be a top five pick. All right, so I'm going to do these six for you, Justin. Yeah, and um, I think, I mean, we hit like one or two of the inserts or the, the base. Um, the base, the, uh, the fast break parallels, but the only relevant thing that was missing, um, I think we might have hit a red to, a random red to whatever the reds are number two. But the only relevant thing that's missing is the Obi top and uh, variation. Dylan Brooks, Isaac Okoro rookie, and a blue DeAndre Jordan. 112 of 175. Maxi Kleba and Jared Allen. Man, what chaos in the NFC East there. He picks 10, 11, and 12. Got a purple here. Capella, Miles Turner, and the purple is Jackson Hayes. There goes Fields. Okay, interesting. Hayes is 39 of 75. Jeremy Grant and Chris Dunn. Uh, fast break prism coming up. Jeremy Lamb. James Wiseman to go with the purple we hit you the other day. Garland. And an Eric Bledsoe. Dennis Schroeder base. I think I'm insert this time. Derek Jones. De'Aaron Fox. Nice RJ Barrett. And a fireworks Jimmy Butler. Tony Snell. So, can someone tell me what the full uh, package was for the Giants? If uh, they know what it is. For me. Uh, I, think, I think you're right, Justin, but I'm not a million percent sure. I haven't opened enough to say that confidently. And I don't know if the fast break version is uh, parallel to the other... Uh, What's it called? Like the other patterns we see in hobby and retail. Marcus Smart, Okongwu, so much Okongwu. I pull him just nonstop. I think it's like his sixth base rookie. And Sadiq Bey, which I, I like very much. Frank Kaminsky, I don't like that very much. And Marvin Bagley. I think the auto's here, maybe? Yeah, all right, auto. Otto Porter, TJ Warren, Luke Kennard, a fearless Steve Nash, and it was a light blue color, so maybe Pukievsky, Josh Richardson. Josh Richardson. Mm. All right. Uh, not our most solid six packs of that. Full Giants Hall is 2021 pick 20, a fifth and a first next year and fourth okay okay so we have the 20th overall this year their 2022 first fourth and sixth and we gave up this year's fifth yeah the, <laughs> those are not the autos you're looking for justin um but again i feel like the auto kind of in this product is like a bonus if you do well with it but i would be making the same I'm making that emoji face in real life. Um, but Justin, I'm not going to add the other ones in right now. I wasn't going to re, I wasn't going to um, reload anything tonight. But if you want them, I'll put them in for you. You just let me know. <laughs> Something better than a coaster. Josh Richardson got traded for. Um, he got traded for someone good. Shit, it was. Uh, oh my god. Who, who was it? I can't even remember now. I'm losing my mind. In the heat deal. Oh, uh, my God. I'm losing my mind. can't even remember. They are. Not a problem at all. Like I said, I wasn't going to um, even listen to the story today. So um, if for whatever reason you change your mind, just let me know. All right, Tang. Series 2. That's a huge haul for the Giants. I'm actually kind of stoked about that.
pick two, one through ten. Wow, Fuge. Really? Ugh. Okay. So there's eight, and I'm going to go with four. All right. Ugh. Ugh. All right, good luck, Tang. See if we can get you a Tatis. CNL Perez rookie. Rowdy Tell is rookie. At least he plays. Nomar Mazzara. Wilmer Font. Windy City Warriors. The White Sox. Gold Jeremy Jeffers. 1434 of 2019. Oh my god, 2011 update! Mike Trout rookie! <laughs> this card's actually a bit more valuable than you think. Um, it actually sells for a little bit. At least the last time I checked it did. This is the card your mom threw out, or iconic card. What is it? Yeah, this is the iconic card reprints. 2011 uh, update Mike Trout. So, cool card. Uh, Greg Allen, Jace Peterson, Jason Vargas, Ender Enciarte, Jacoby Jones, and a nice Freddie Peralta. All right, let's see if we can get Mr. Tatis. Jake Cave, Johnny Field, Kevin Newman, a couple rookies there, Straz, the Giants, Michael Waka. And a 150th logo, wrong Padre though, Greg Garcia. Mookie, uh, those are the retail exclusive Mookie Betts highlights. Looks like he's doing a little dance. Ryan Brazier, Gary Sanchez, Herman Marquez, Travis Shaw, Alex Cobb, and San Diego Sluggers, it's Hosmer and Hunter Renfro. So a couple Padres cards, but not the one we were looking for. But I do appreciate the purchase, and um, Sweet Trout, <laughs> you're welcome, dude. You're very welcome. There goes Parsons. I was, I was hoping the Giants might take him. But I like what the Giants did better, so... Alright guys. Yeah, he's uh he's very good. I mean Danny's gonna get smoked no matter what. They have no offensive line. That's the, like that's like the worst thing about the Giants trading out of that spot is they probably wish, they I, I mean I think Parsons was probably at the top of their board, but now he gets to just kill us. So that's cool. Parsons is just a beast. Uh, because we stink. That would be the correct answer. Because we were terrible. I think it was um, eight or nine weeks into the season, we had a combined, like... I think it was eight weeks into the season, we had a combined, like, five wins. And three of them were against each other. It was it was the most hilarious, like, standings I've ever seen in my whole life. It might not have been that far, but it was something like that, where it was, like, almost... It, it was basically, like, one win per week combined amongst the entire NFC East with uh, with over 50% of them coming against the other teams in the NFC East. It was about halfway through the season. And then finally we started playing each other a little bit more and we started getting some wins. And... But it was it was on pace to be by far and away the worst division in football history. So that, that made for some great football. Very enjoyable stuff to watch. <laughs>
All right, guys, we got a little lull in the action here, so I'm just going to run upstairs for two seconds, and uh, I think I'm going to grab a protein bar. I need a little something to eat and a water. So I'll be back in uh, one more minute. All right, guys, I am back. Apologies. This the third time I've done lunch stairs today. What am I doing? All right. I miss anything here? All right, let's get something going here. Um, take a look in the store. What's going on? Uh, Maddie, if you're still in here, I just saw your email. I will take care of that for you. I don't know if you're in the room right now, but... Oh, what's up, Derek? Sorry, I wasn't looking at the uh, the screen there. Four Eyes is going to do some F1 Chrome, love it. And then we're going to do a little bit more UFC Hobby for Lou. Uh, I'd love some Hamilton. We've, been, we've done very well with... Uh, F1 Chrome. If you uh, take a look at my Instagram, you'll see I only it limit. I thought you could do 12 pictures. It limited me to 10, but I put up a bunch of the awesome UFC or UFC the uh, F1 Chrome stuff we've hit uh, in the past week or so on there. So you can go ahead and take your pick here, one through I think it's 10, one through 10. 
pull. Wow. 1475 for the purple. My God. Two and seven. All right. Three, four, five, six, and seven. All right. Let's get it, four eyes. Good luck, buddy. What's up, Jim? Nothing notable out of this box yet. Uh, Max Verstappen, the Reno DP World F1 team logo. There's a Luham, the France winner. Looks like he's going for a jog in the mountains. And we got a gold. What about that? Thanks, Jim. I appreciate it. I, uh, I've i never had a card damage in transit that wasn't, like, blatantly damaged by the post office. Like, you know, like, ran over by the truck or something or, like, thrown in the ocean. So, I appreciate that. Is there another Lewis that we could hit? Probably not. There you go. How about Lewis Hamilton, the Grand Prix winner of Bahrain? Gold to 50. I told you nothing good to come out of his box yet. For our 8 of 50, and unfortunately, this is something we've noticed a bunch with the gold refractors. Pretty much every gold refractor that we've seen has this, like, lip. It's uh, it's where the, the back has the surface peeling. We noticed in the full case that we, uh, we opened that pretty much every gold refractor had it. So I continue to check. Um, so and it continues to be there. And these are different cases, too, so... Yeah, we were just talking about the uh, purple number one. I think Derek said it went for almost 1500 bucks, but it's still a great card. Not taking away from it. Uh, awesome. I just wanted to let you know that when you get it in, because you'll probably see it in hand. And I figured it was probably already going to be uh, be here. So, yeah, sucks. But, great card. Oh, you still got another pack left. Carlos Sainz, Callum Milot, Pierre Gasly, and well, that's a good two-pack lot. Verstappen ref uh, Refractor from the Grand Prix Austria. <laughs> vroom, vroom. <laughs> that's for sure. It's at least four cars. It's four cars on the five-car scale. So, nice two packs there, buddy. Congratulations. And then Lou wants fire after this. With Prism. This Prism box has been hot. Uh, yes, there is. There is. You're very welcome, Four Eyes. Um, and then Lou has one of these, I believe. All right, Lou, one through three. Lou's going two, all right. All right, Derek Lewis, Calvin Katar, Alexander Rakic, Ier Rodriguez. I swear, when I don't flip them, they always face the wrong way, and every time I flip them, then they are now then facing the wrong way. A nice McGregor base. Ooh, I think we got the auto here. I think we do. Ed Herman Red. Save the auto. Khabib Fireworks. Yan Jaonan, rookie. Antonia Shevchenko. Jennifer Maya. Dominic Reyes. And the auto. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Tom Cruise. A name I recognize. The Herman is uh, 93 of 275. So Dominic Cruise auto. That's pretty solid. Connor Bass. And a Dominic Cruise auto. This box, literally every single pack has been good in this box. Every single one. So there you go, Lou. Congrats, buddy. I know you had a stack from yesterday, because I 
was trying to pronounce your name, and you're like, bro, it's just my first name's Lou. I was like, ah, well, I can stop trying to sound this out like a a French moron. I was like, is it Lou Genot? <laughs> there it is. All right, and then. Yeah, I was like, is it Luge? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> then T, do Jimmy. You got uh, one or two? Let me pick. All right, I'll go top. <laughs> Good luck, bud. Ooh, we got a... Uh, haven't seen this color yet. It's like a, like a light blue, maybe, or actual... That's not the dark blue. That's all I know. <laughs> Ketlin Vieira, Uriah Faber, Ricardo Lamas, Arnold Allen, Brandon Royval, and the color we haven't seen yet, Sean O'Malley. Ah, uh, it's the Conor McGregor imposter. Not sure what color we're calling this. Is that, I guess, blue, maybe? We'll look in a second. Silver, upside down. Juliana Pena. That's got to be solid. It's another name that I know. 49 on the O'Malley. Uh, O'Malley. 45 of 49. So I don't know if that's blue or maybe teal. Yeah, right? Just the the world's fake is Conor McGregor. I really shouldn't say that because this guy will whoop my ass if he ever heard me say that. But I doubt he's on stream right now. So, And a nice Pena Silver. This box has been so much better. We've had like hits of people I recognize, so that's that's always good. Uh, Francis Naganu, Fearless, Cody Garbrandt, Diego Ferreira, Alexander Gustafson, and Chaos Williams. Uh, thank you for that. Uh, thank you for that, T. Jimmy. I know you have a stack here somewhere as well. There it is. The Faber's cool. That's the first time we've seen him um, at all in uh, the two two or so boxes. So he was big back in the day, man. I remember when he was like the guy. He's, he's short. I, it's funny that I called him big back in the day. He's short. Um, but he was in a couple movies and stuff, wasn't he, when he got like famous and good? I remember seeing him on SportsCenter um, randomly, like, you know, not talking about UFC, like talking about just like, uh, you know, just random stuff. I feel like he had some endorsement deals and he was on TV. He was one of like the earlier, uh, I'm gonna use my UFC to like get gigs outside of UFC guys. Yeah, he's, I mean, he was a good fighter too. That's like around when I was like kind of into UFC because I was, I was a little bit younger and I was staying up much later than I do now, except for when I'm streaming, but that's cool. And it's good stuff. Oh, no problem, buddy. All right, um... Parker's Cards, Kevin H, LT1J, my other friend Jay, Tailgater Jay. So we got a bunch of good stuff out here on the table. If anyone has any questions about any products, I know we got a bunch of people on the uh, on the Loop app tonight, which I'm happy to see. I'm excited for that. Funny, I, I actually uh, my wife my wife told me that someone was uh, selling singles. I didn't know uh, you could do that, or I mean, I'm sure you could. I didn't know uh, that that was a thing, so. Tang's going to do Series 2 Retail one more time. And then, um, Kevin, so I've just got some EPL stuff here. Um, I have seven packs left in a hobby box, and then I've got three packs left from a uh, breakaway box. The breakaway box, um, the purchase for that, you get three. You would get all three packs. And I do have another breakaway box that I would open if you wanted to pick your three packs from that box as opposed to taking the three from this one. Um, we haven't hit anything notable that would say you should do one or the other, but those are the two that I have, and I love opening EPL stuff. It's, like, my favorite. So, um, but Tang, go ahead. Uh, one through eight, buddy. All right, me. All right, three, seven. Uh, 
The sealed box? Give me a second and I will check and see what I can do on the full box for you. Let me just uh, take care of this, this one right here and I will let you know. All right. Brandon Drury, Willie Adonis, Alan Hansen, Masahiro Tanaka, Cam Gallagher. Got a Buster Posey franchise feats and the home run challenge of Freddie Freeman, which doesn't mean anything now because that is well expired. Trevor Story, Luis Ortiz rookie, Brian Goodwin, Bregman, Zach Wheeler, Max Stassi, and Mike Montgomery. All right, let's see. Come on, one time, Taddy. Howie Kendrick, Daniel Megden, Carlos Tochi, Kevin Kiermeyer, the Twins Stadium, Longoria Franchise Feats, Ian Hatt, Austin Romine, Chase Fry, Vince Velasquez, Tony Kemp, Chris Shaw, rookie, Stanton, and Rossiel Iglesias. So I did not do well. I'm sorry, Tang. Sorry, buddy. I didn't pick the best ones for you, my friend. I appreciate you. I'm from Jersey, so you know, NYC Jersey. We're like we're like brothers, basically. Oh, hell yeah, I'm a Mets fan. Absolutely. I didn't look at my phone for like 10 hours last night because I was streaming. I refused to look at my phone until I could get into work because I, I didn't want to see DeGrom. I didn't want to know anything that happened. I wanted to watch the rerun of the game. And in typical Mets fashion, obviously, DeGrom just six innings three hits, one earned, one walk, nine strikeouts lost, because the Mets can never score. It's unbelievable. I, I can go on Mets tangents for hours. Just, I know what you meant. <laughs> if, you, if you said, we can hit, I was like, okay, this guy's not a Mets fan. He's crazy. He's not a Mets fan. He's an idiot. <laughs> but, yeah. I, DeGrom is must-see TV. Um, but, Kevin, let me check on the EPL box for you real quick. Just get my numbers up here. I'll let you know. One more second. One more second here. I didn't have it priced out by the box, so I just got to double check. Oh, I also have UEFA Champions League uh, Museum here. forgot about that. Where the hell is it? do it at 310 for the EPL breakaway box. 310. So I think that's a pretty good deal if you're still in here. Uh, yeah, it's unbelievable. I mean, the guy was hitting 600 too, Tang. So Kevin, if you're in here, I can do a 310 on the EPL breakaway box. I don't know if you're in here or not, but
It's yeah. Degrom's so good. I I love the guy. He's so good. All right. Well, so it's funny. Uh, Frank is actually my – he's, like, my favorite player. He was my favorite player before the Mets got him. Um, I was a Mets fan and a Lindor fan. I liked, I loved him ever since I've, – I've been collecting him since 2011. Um, but – and then he went to the Mets, and I was like, I'm very happy, but I'm so, like, upset at the same time because I just know what's going to happen. Like, I just I, – I've followed this franchise forever. We don't get saviors, you know. Anything nice that we have just somehow just, like, you know, fades into black. It's just – He'll, his bat will come around, but I just I just want to win. I just want to win some damn baseball games. I just want I want more than three hits. That's all. That's all I want. I'm not asking for much. I just want the bullpen not to blow it all the time, every time. Just simple stuff. Yeah, let's get back to the playoffs. That would be great. Just get me get me to September when we're still in the playoff race. Oh, I'm. I told you, <laughs> Kyle. I can rant. On the Mets forever. Well, I mean, the Mets bullpen was probably the scariest thing on earth. It was like uh, it, the the Mets bullpen to me is like the dentist to like a four year old. It's just like terrifying. It's like I can't think of anything scarier, you know. Um, but it has been a little bit better. I mean, like, to, but to start the season it was embarrassing. It was uh, like, like Trevor May went out there and he was like, you know, like rolling like a beach ball, is what it looked like. So. They've gotten a little bit better the past uh, past week and a half. So. Ooh, more racing. Kitwee, what's up, buddy? I haven't been able to check the uh, the forum since I, I posted. Um, just updating it on the, uh, the break that... Uh, I don't know if you happen to notice. Did anyone else uh, grab any more spots in that? The half case. And then uh, you can go ahead and take your pick here. One through eight. Okay, no worries. I, you don't. You don't have to go look or anything like that. I was just curious if you happen to notice. Kobe tribute pick. I like it. Good luck. Got a purple MP Motorsport team. Lewis Hamilton award winners. Is that the photo variation? Uh, maybe because we have a refractor and a purple here. That's kind of weird. Photo variation, maybe? Maybe? I think it is. We'll check in just a second here. And a purple Nicholas Latifi. 344 of 399. That Botas is card 175. That does not look a, a familiar picture to me. And we never have two thick cards in the same pack. I mean, it's happened like once. So that might be, that could be. I thought they were low numbers too. I just don't remember this picture. And that was just kind of a weird pack then. So it might not be, but the card is thicker than the base stock. I can't even tell. I don't think it is. Maybe not. I might just be losing my mind. That might have just been a weird pack that had two things in it. I'll check the checklist here in just a second. Another Verstappen. Daruvala. Nice Toto. And the Haas car. Haas F1, the VF20. Let me check real fast. Uh, I can pull up the list of photo variations here. Variations are 
Yeah, they're all the low numbers. So that definitely was not it. He is. He does have one in the set, but uh, that was not it. So interesting. Yeah, the low, the uh, card number two is the one in the set for him that has a variation. So thank you, buddy. I'll add that to your pile from the other day. find it. There it is. All right. All right, guys. What's going on here now? Thanks. So everyone's been telling me about this. I gotta watch it. You're like the fourth or fifth person to just say it's like the best thing ever. Um, the reason why it's so expensive is there is no licensed F1 cards ever. This is it. So I mean, well, they made Dynasty, which is a different a different beast. Uh, that's a one card per pack product, very high end. But um, this is it. These this will be the set for any of these racers. Anyone that's in this set, this F1 Chrome set, this will be their premier card probably. Um, as far as a rookie card goes for a licensed product. Some of them might appear in stuff like stickers or stuff like that, like some quirky off-brand type things. Um, I'm sure they, they do. like some Similar to how like, the soccer players are in stickers where they have weird like club cards and stuff like that. It'll be very similar like uh, to that where like for the 90s and mid, to, uh, mid and early 2000s soccers, but that's why it's so expensive. Especially when you have like one of the best racers, at least of all time, here in uh, Hamilton in the set, and then you know, it's like imagine if Tom Brady didn't have a rookie card until 15 years in his career. Oh, that's crazy. 4 a.m. I mean, I've done the same thing for Kyle Lowry, um, but yeah, the Hamilton stuff is crazy. We were just saying a card. So his true base rookie um, card number one. Uh, a purple refractor number to three ninety nine just sold for fifteen hundred dollars today. So uh, one through six on this one, Kitty. But yeah, fifteen hundred just for the purple to three ninety nine. So crazy. I gotta watch this series. I might I might put it on tomorrow in the office. I've been watching like stupid history documentaries about like Notre Dame and Da Vinci and crap like that, but. I think I'll switch it up and uh, I'll blow through the blow through that instead. Ooh, we got a foil. I hope it's something good. Carl Edwards, Morales, Kevin Pr, Chaz Rowe, the Tigers, and Josh James rookie foil board. Jacob Faria, Pablo Lopez rookie, the 1984. Adam Duvall, Taylor Rogers. Uh, Oledmo Vargas, Bryce Harper, Starlin Castro, and Jorge Alfaro. Saw the funniest tweet today, making fun of the Yankees. Uh, <laughs> it was, Bryce Harper takes a 97 mile per hour fastball off his face, is fine to play. Aaron Judge missing second straight game due to travel soreness. <laughs> oh, funny. Funny, funny, funny. Malik Smith, Pablo Reyes rookie, Wainwright, Chris Martin cool card. I love this card. I have the, uh, they are very sad. They're pathetic. They, I mean, you think we can't hit, they can't hit. Um, I have the Sapphire version of this card, the Top Scrum Sapphire version of this card at PSA right now. I would highly recommend that anyone who's a Braves fan or thinks that they might be good, grab a Sapphire version of this card. Um, super underrated, especially if they, uh, wind up living up to their potential. I know the NL East is sacked, and and such, but I love that card. I think it's a kind of a sleeper. Victor Caratini, what's up, Will? Pat Veleka, Mookie Betts highlights. Eric Thames, Jimmy Yacobonis, Wilson Ramos. Wilson Ramos, another. As soon as I leave the Mets, I I'm just the best player ever. Special. Matt Kemp, Christopher Negron, and Fulty. So still no Tatis. He is eluding us. 
No Tatis. No Tatis. Yeah, I was saying, Mats? What about Chris Flexen? Chris Flexen just dealing in Seattle. Wilson Ramos, Travis Darno. What about Jed Lowry? You want to get sad? Look at Jed Lowry. I want to go sit in a corner and like just eat ice cream by myself. Yeah. You should see our group text, man. <laughs> like, what did Jed Lowry have? Nine at bats last year? No hits? Oh, uh, now he's like in like 370 with like eight homers. Thanks for coming, Jed. You dick. Oh, man. Mets. Ooh, we knew a tribute. Yeah. I mean, the good news is, is for investment purposes, I know exactly who to buy in the offseason. It's whoever left the Mets. Just immediately. And anyone that's coming to the Mets, offload as soon as possible. Uh, fresh box, buddy. One through six. It's literally the easiest investing strategy of all time. Maybe I can make a Fortune 500 company out of this. Just fade the Mets. <laughs> I like Dom Smith. 2013 uh, Bowman Chrome. I, I like J.D. Davis, too. It's just, unfortunately, he's a little bit old. I mean, Smith's not young either, but Smith can race. Actually, uh, all the Mets guys are kind of in that same boat of Smith, Conforto, J.D. Davis. They can all hit. That's a great purchase. Beautiful. We pulled two of them yesterday. All right, got an auto. Otani, Trevor Story, and we, we pulled a gold refractor, too, of the DeGrom uh, rookie update, or our rookie debut from update, excuse me. That was like the first pack we opened to that stuff. It was amazing. Blue, rookie, Sixto Sanchez. So he's got six in his name, but this is clearly the first time he's used a pen. Good card, though. Very, very good prospect. Uh, he's on the shelf right now. I don't think he's come back yet. Um, I think he's still hurt. But, yeah, I'm excited to watch him pitch. He's got electric stuff. I watched him on uh, MILB TV a couple times in the past few years. So, definitely a good player. Uh, I'd like to see him get get healthy, though, and on the field. So, a nice card there, for sure. But penmanship, thumbs down. Three thumbs down. Six thumbs down. Elo, what's up? Jay Brown? What's up, guys? Man, no one wants to hang out with me tonight. I appreciate you guys that have been here for a little while. Chat's been uh, hovering between only a couple viewers for, uh, for a while. That's okay. Oh yeah, I, I'm probably scaring. We're probably scaring people off. <laughs> They're like, I don't want to listen to this depressing crap. I don't come on here to get sad. <laughs> All right, Jay Brown, um, you got to pick a box for me to start with. Box one or box two? Box two. All right. So box two has eight packs left. I feel ya. We're just, just born into just a terrible choice. Uh, F1 has been nice. We actually just hit, we hit a Lewis Hamilton gold just a uh, couple minutes ago. Uh, it wasn't the, uh, the Drew Rickard. It was one of the, it was the Grand Prix Bayron. But um, still a very nice card, number to 50. And then right after that was a Verstappen Refractor. But no autos or anything, so... It was a nice Botox refractor, definitely. Forgot about that. I think we got an Atomic Auto. Oh, let's go, Jay Brown. Atomic Auto, we're going to save it to the end. So, you have a Marco Luciano Top 100. Let's go! Acosta, first, that's a good one there. Hassel, Ivan Johnson, Volpe, a nice Helio Ramos Purple Refractor. 
the 250. Waters, Jung, Westberg, Miller, Poisson, Trammell, Boz, Langoliers, Laura, Detmers, Chapman, Baez, Merrifield, Ruiz, Patino, Trout, Castillo, Howard, Marte, Votto, Hura, uh, Buster Posey, Garrett Cole, Austin Meadows, and a Rookie of the Year favorites, Ryan Mountcastle. And... Angel Martinez, 24 of 100. Let's see who he is. So I'm learning all these. If they don't have um, a base, a, a card in the base set, I'm learning them right here with you. Son of Sandy Martinez, former catcher. Younger brother of Sandy Jr., Diamondbacks prospect. Uh, number 23 Indians prospect. He's born in 02, so very young. Going to make his debut this year, so he has no stats available, but he did hit... Uh, not, he had 19 multi-hit games in the 2019 Dominican Summer League, including a 341 average in June. Uh, intelligent, versatile defender. I like that. So, the younger the better for me. No clue who he is either. Um, so, yeah. No, I, I was saying it before. I mean, the back of the baseball card always makes you sound good. Um, but yeah, doesn't sound like a bad prospect. You usually want to avoid stuff when they say, like, when they start talking about, like, their, you know, fourth season in the minors and yada, 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 but. Oh, nice. Nice Sabato. But, yeah, there's a, there's a couple guys you can tell from reading the back of the card where even if, you know, you can kind of read through the nonsense, like they're trying to put nice stuff in there, because um, they'll say stuff like, you know, Recorded back-to-back multi-hit games for the first time in August, and I was like, "Okay, is that that's really the highlight of this person's like re, uh, career or something like that?" You know. So, but this one seems pretty solid. So I will add it to your stack. I know you got one from yesterday. Gotta find it though. Give me half a second, and then I heard it ding. I don't know what it was. All right. What do we got here? Smith's going to do some F1. Sweet. All right. Wow, back-to-back -back Smith. So we got Smith Dobby and then Smitty Pitt joined. All right, so Smith, Smith Dobby is going with F1, and then we got another Bowman Jumbo. All right, so one through six on F1 Smith, and then Marino, he'll get your pick on Jumbo, my friend. So pick two here, two and four. The most popular choice, I swear. I feel like that's like half the uh, half the choices is two, four. Two, four, and three, seven, are, and then two, two, three, three. Those, those are the four that I get all the time. All the time. All right, let's do it. Good luck, brother. Vettel. Grand Prix Canada, Christian Lungard, F2 Team Trident, and Marcus Armstrong, Art Grand Prix, Refractor, followed by, we got an auto, hot, oh my gosh, huh. <laughs> oh my god. I'm going to fold that over one more time and tell you, tell me if you can see why I'm saying, oh my God. Can you see what that says up there? Uh, it says Aston. So I'm going to hold it high. I don't want... I don't want to spoil it. I'm not going to look. Let's take a look at the color. Who cares about the base cards here? It is a gold. Gold Auto, Aston Martin Red Bull. Here we go. Leclerc, Alessi, Raikkonen, this way, I just want to make sure. Okay. <sighs> All right. Good luck, dude. Just, just for stabbing it one time. 
Albon. Alex Albon, gold rookie auto. Still very nice. It's okay. I mean, um, the heart was racing there for a minute. I mean, that's a hell of a two-pack pull. No, no doubt about it. What a little run we're on here with uh, Chrome. So I know he just got uh, demoted or whatever the, the word is before the uh, the season started. Because I was looking into him when um, when F1 Dynasty came out. But if that was a Verstappen... Ugh, ugh. <laughs> Still a great card, though. Great card. Wow. Huge. Fantastic. Congratulations. Not bad for a first purchase. All right. Uh, and then we got Marino's going to do some Bowman here. So thanks again, Smith. I'm getting like, F1's getting me so into, or these cards are getting me so into F1, I gotta watch the docu-series now. Just that, that way I can know a little bit more about what I'm talking about, outside of just knowing the names and getting excited. <laughs> Alright, Marino, you got, uh, we have two boxes here. Do you want to pick out of box number one or box number two? Nice. All right. Cool. How how many episodes are there? Tang. Pick one. Thirty minutes piece. Okay. Cool. All right. We'll go. We'll go right here. For you, buddy. Good luck, Marino. Let's see if we can. Now that we hit. Uh, I was going to make like an Aston, an Austin Martin, Aston Martin joke, but I just, I'm going to punt on it. Ooh, I think we got a refractor auto. I think I picked good. I think I picked well. I done did good. Scooble, Schmidt, McKenzie rookie, Ian Anderson rookie, Madrigal rookie, Garrett Crochet rookie. Altuve, Cronenworth rookie, Campusano rookie, Acuna, Bieber, Yelich, Murphy, Kyle Lewis, Sixto Sanchez rookie of the year favorites, and I, oh, I lied, I got faked out. It's always in this spot right here, and I thought this border was a refractor auto, but it's just the, ta the edge of the talent pipeline set just looks very similar. So, my fault. Sorry. <laughs> J-Rod, Kalenic, and... McCogan, Bryson Stott, top 100, Alex Ramirez, Royce Lewis, Edward Cabrera, Tevin Vavra, Nolan Gorman, Lynch, Dahlquist, Sodershum, Gore, Beater, Green, Sabato first, that's a nice one, Salas first, is, uh, Spencer Torkelson, and Volpe. Sorry for the fake out, that was totally my bad. Yeah, definitely got me good on that one. Sorry, Marino, but... Nice Sabato. I appreciate the purchase. Jump the gun. Ooh. Talking about the Giants now. Like, what position do the Giants need? Uh, all of them? Are they looking at the linebacker from Kentucky right now? I forget his name. That's got to be what they're looking at. I was going to do one more set of chromes. Hey, does someone let me know who the Giants pick? Uh, 
One through four, four eyes. One, four, all right. Good luck. Ooh, we got a track tags. Christian Horner. Written the card fell oddly thick. Gunther Steiner. Nice George Russell rookie. And our track tags is the smooth operator. I think that's Carlos Sainz. Yes, Carlos Sainz from McLaren. Damn you, Max Verstappen. Why couldn't it be you? Why was it Albon? But uh, nice Max Verstappen. Uh, Pedro Piquet. George Russell. Freshest rookie. And Lance Stroll. BWT Racing Point car. So, thank you, Four Eyes. Oh, yeah, only two cars on that one. That's two out of five cars <laughs> is our rating on that one. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, DK, I can open a new box of UFC. Um, which one are you talking about, Four Eyes? Uh, F1. So I actually, um, I, I ran a case break um, on the blog cards forums. Uh, we had it on presale. Um, so I got lucky. Uh, one of the rounds, the autos are going out of the. Uh, yes, the last pack does not have an auto. I don't know about the parallels, obviously, DK, but the autos are going from the box for the one pack that's in the store. Um, but we opened. Um, I got lucky in the case, and I. Uh, I hit the uh, AMG Mercedes spot in one of the rounds, and each round was for three boxes worth. So I got a bunch of Hamiltons. I got two purples to three ninety nine. I got one of the True Base number ones. I got one of the track tags. Um, my other spots all did terrible, but it was nice. All right, I owe him now. Oh no! <laughs> all right. Um, ah. You want me to pick again? Okay. Um, let's go. Down here. All right. Let's see. Let's see what this one has in store. Good luck, buddy. But uh, the big, the big crazy one for us was we locked into F1 Dynasty back in last March or April at twenty. I think it was like $2,500 a case. And by the time they came out, they were almost $2,000 a box. And we got we got five boxes. It's a five-box case. So that was awesome. I didn't get in that break. Um, I was just running that one. I didn't have any spots. But that one was crazy. That was the best, uh, like, of our F1 stories to date. So we had some good cards, too. They're on my Instagram, a couple of them. But, all right. For Marino, let's see if we can get them one time. Hoke, Sam Huff. Varsho, Brady Singer, Alec Bohm, Arenado, Soto, Bell, Mookie, Bregman, Abreu, Tatis, Rendon, Mountcastle. Is it an atomic auto? Another one? Or is this an insert? Oh, I think we might have an insert auto or an atomic auto. This is definitely the top 100 set, but it's an atomic and it's in the auto spot. So I don't know what's going on here. So we have not seen an atomic insert yet uh, out of a handful of boxes that doesn't mean they don't exist and could be numbered i don't know we're going to find out right here peraza trevor stephan and armando alvarez pipeline for the yankees and the atomic top 100 is xavier edwards so they are numbered to 150 41 of 150 on the atomic insert good player too i like xavier edwards a lot he will be a solid major leaguer very nice card. The Atomic on this looks way better than the regular one. Um, I'm not the biggest fan of the design with the color, the green and red and all that stuff, but it kind of fades away with the Atomic design here, so. Very nice. 
Very nice Edwards. And a Royce Lewis, number 10. Yason Rosario, Colton Welker. That's a nice chrome. Mick Abel, 15th overall, 2020. Uh, Justin Foscu, nice Bayron Laura, top prospect. Zach Veen, Ishmael Mania, Lacey, Kirby, Garcia, Woods Richardson, Mauricio, Witt, Manning, and Hunter Green. Hey, Butters. I'm obligated to say hi to my wife every time she jumps in the room, just so you guys know. It's not that I'm ignoring the rest of you that are coming in. It's um, I, made, I made her a promise um, that I would say hi to her because I spend so much time with you guys, I have to neglect her. It's kind of like a, uh, you know... Oh, no problem, buddy. Oh, they took a receiver? Kadarius Tony. Not even on my radar. Know nothing about him. I Nothing. Oh, the, the Giants are just so... They're so Giants. My goodness. Oh, you're welcome, Marino. I don't know if I said that or not. Um, but... Thank you. I appreciate the purchases, buddy. He looks tiny. Looks like Kadarius Tiny. The small guy. Yeah, I figured as much when I saw him lining up to return punts. He looks like a like an like an like an X wing, like an X back, where he's gonna line up in the backfield, he's gonna line up in the slot, he's gonna line up out wide. Good night, butters, smooches. I mean that that was a nice little highlight there. All right, well, we'll see what happens. I mean, that's the thing is I, I still would just like a lineman that actually blocks because, like, I'm I'm still distraught about the last year's disaster. I'm, yeah, got to gotta be trendy. Got to be the trendy people and just pass on Werfs and Jedrick Wills even and got to take Andrew Thomas. Oh, my goodness. It just, it just stinks of Eric. It reeks of Eric Flowers all over again. Eric Flowers wasn't. We passed on other players. Eric Flowers was, well, they took Brandon Scherf right in front of us, so let's just take a guy who should go in the second round because he's the next best good lineman, apparently. Eric Flowers is the worst. Like, the worst of all time. I, I'll never forget there was a game, it was like a Sunday night game or a Monday night game, and it started off with an Eric Flowers fall star, an Eric, Fla uh, Eric Flowers hold, and then Eric Flowers tripping in the end zone for a safety. On like It was like five plays, and that's what happened. Done. Just TV off. Can't. Can't do it. <laughs> he sucks so bad. Kind of turned his career around a little bit, though. He plays guard now. Um, he was just not meant to be a tackle. He wasn't fast enough. He didn't have the foot speed. But uh, he was with Washington for a year, and I can't remember where he went after that. Maybe he's still in Washington. I can't remember. I don't know. I try not to pay attention to Eric Flowers because, like, you know, screw Eric Flowers. But what's up, Kyle? I'm going to uh, probably go to uh, 11 o'clock or so unless we uh, we start moving through so, some more stuff. Um, I'm going to not do a 2 a.m. night tonight, I don't think. Now, of course, that could change if we start uh, flying through some more product here. But I... Um... <laughs> I'm too jealous. <laughs> so what, 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 is the, what is the draft? What's the, what's the drinking rules for the draft game? Kevin Porter scored had a 50 and 10. Wow. All right, well, what's what's the funniest rule? Like is it something like you make fun of Mel Kiper or you drink every time Mel Kiper does something? What's the what's the best rule? If you had to pick the best rule you have in your game here. I'm assuming it's just a standard drinking game.
Uh, all right, guys, I'm gonna give it like I said, like ten more minutes unless we start moving through some stuff here. I know I didn't have the. Uh... Oh, we're going back for some more. I know I didn't have a uh, the selection I normally do. I just kind of have the stuff from yesterday, so I usually like to kind of switch stuff in and out. But I, uh, I couldn't make an order today because our internet was dead. So, so two four. Are we switching up the uh, the number of choice? All right, two four. Um, Got a couple couple items in here that um, surprise no one's gone after. The ninety seven Bowman's best was fun yesterday. Um, let's do this first though. Frazier, Robbie Erlin, nice. Robert Stock, wrong Padre rookie. I've been saying wrong Padre a lot in this break. Tommy Hunter, Pablo Sandoval, Giolito, Bill Mazeroski, one hundred fifty years. Kingery, Drew Verhagen, G-Man Choi, Magnus Sierra, Aaron Sanchez, Luke Voigt, and Jason Castro. All right, let's see if we can get it here. Come on, Taddy. No Tatis is yet here, and this was, this was two blasters worth of stuff, and no Tatis so far. Ferguson, Lonnie Chisenhall, Miles Straw, Justin Smoke, Roman Quinn, Tucker Barnhart, Stanton, 150th. Another one of the Mookie Betts highlights. Pujols, Miguel Rojas, John Hicks, Brian Johnson, Jay Happ, and Greg Bird. Nothing there. Brandon Nimmo in the house. He's back. We hit uh, one Alonzo, though, and uh, the Vlad no number, which was great. Uh, that was the other day, though. But no, uh, no Tatis. No Tatis and no Eloys. A couple products, if anyone's looking for inside track on stuff, um, would be Series 2. Uh, like I said, no Tatis or Eli yet out of these two sets of blasters. 18 Heritage High number. We have four packs left. We have not hit um, the action or color swap or whatever the special card is. Um, I don't think they're guaranteed one per box, but it's usually they're usually one per box. I don't want to tell you that they are guaranteed and then they're not being there, but... Um, very high confidence I'm saying that with that there is a color variation or, an, or a color swap or an action variation or a throwback or something more rare in there also haven't hit anything outside of a base chrome from the chrome sets um, 12 13 prestige uh, we've gone through half the box but we still have two autos left um, for sure what else is floating around Ben Baller chrome uh, we've only hit two two decent... I think we've gone through like maybe a third of the box. We've hit a Bichette rookie and a... We might have hit a Trent Frisham rookie. I, I can't even remember. Um, and then a random gold refractor, but there still should be the die cut and probably four more, three or four more numbered refractors in there. Um, and then hopefully your Alvarez, Robert, a Rosarena. Um... Prism Basketball Hobby, we haven't hit an auto. And I think we've gone through uh, four of the 12 packs there. Uh, finest, finest Flashbacks Baseball, we hit a refractor, but it wasn't anything special. Tailgater, what's up? Uh, so, oh, Select Football. Haven't had a hit yet, halfway through the box. No hits whatsoever. Sorry, not halfway. We have seven packs left. So there should be two autos and a relic in these seven packs in my hand. And then Prism No Huddle Football. The auto's gone, but that doesn't matter. It was very bad to begin with, and uh, that's a product where the auto's kind of a bonus. Not, not really what you're looking for. If you get a good auto, good for you. Um, we're looking for the low numbered parallels, really, um, which we have not gotten any. As of yet, so there should still be. Uh, we got one. We got. I lied. There was a um, Cleveland Feral to fifty, but the highest number parallel in that box is number to seventy-five. So there should st uh, should still be uh, four to five more parallels in there, and the photo variation. Plus, uh, both those twenty twenty football products. You have a shot at Jordan Love, who is uh, the high riser right now 
as far as prices go because of the Aaron Rodgers news. So I think that's kind of it. So if anyone would like to grab anything, so I'm going to hang out for a couple more minutes here, um, and then I'll work on it tomorrow to do a little restock, hopefully, of, uh, of some of these products. Um, I don't know if I'm going to go on tomorrow. I might just spend tomorrow uh, shipping for you guys. That way I can get as much out as possible before the weekend actually starts. So I got to see how my day goes. One more tribute for my boy Kippy. All right. One through five, buddy. P. Gore, what's going on? Pick an auto, please. Um, let's. Mm, just gonna close my eyes and just see where my fingers land. Did I grab only one pack? Good. Oh, okay. <laughs> no idea if this is gonna work or not. Forty percent. Let's see. I literally closed my eyes. I think I got a relic. Oh, nope. I think I got an auto and an extra card. Look at that. Haha. -ha. So I think we got the rookies uh, insert probably. So Chapman. We did, and it's a nice one. Dylan Carlson. Oh, that's a great pack. Got a green parallel too back here. Gary Green to 79. Carlson. Look at that. The blind man leading you to the promised land. All right, auto, let's see. I think it's just the base auto, but it's a good one. Hall of Famer, short print, 26 of 100, Ozzy Smith. All right. <laughs> Pretty solid. No problem. <laughs> that was my most uh, ingenious uh, picking attempt yet. Close my eyes and just whatever, whatever I grab. All right, take it easy, brother. I'm probably about to be out too here in just a couple minutes, so um, I want to get catch up on some sleep. I can't do a 2 a.m. night every night, so. Ethan, Grant, what's up? Oh. Woo. Well, we'll do another last call here. Another last call. A couple more minutes. If anyone has any questions about anything in the store or anything, you let me know. And again, I will, um, oh, what's up, Woody? All right, Woody is going through Prestige, so got two autos left in here for sure. Yep, so one through 12, and we have not seen a good rookie yet. Best rookie we've seen is Draymond Green. They're one per pack. Number nine. Four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. Good luck, bud. I think there's a one relic per box, too, which we we haven't hit a relic yet. I can't remember for sure, but I think it's two autos and one relic. All right, three autos and one relic per box. So there might be a jersey floating around in here as well. Like in this pack. <laughs> yeah, definitely got a hit here. Might be a jersey. Could be a jersey auto. Let's find out. Good luck, buddy. Michael Beasley. Grant Hill. Richard Hamilton, Luis Scola, Lou Williams, and it is a jersey. It's Ty Lawson inside the numbers. 6.6 .6 assists per game. That is unnumbered. And I'm not going to lie, this is a player who I've never seen a card of them before in my entire life. Terrell Harris. I've been pulling some obscure references from this set, from the other packs, about Juwan Johnson and... Chris Joseph and a couple others, but never Terrell Harris. Hmm. I mean, unbelievable. He's he's an NBA champion. 
Who knew? Terrell Harris, NBA champion. He won on the Heat's first team that beat the Thunder. <laughs> well, color me shocked. And here I was saying that this guy I was getting ready to be like, yeah, he probably never even played in the league. NBA champion. And I open cards for a living. So, who am I to slander? Ray Allen and Danny Granger is going to do it. Well, interesting pack. Definitely learned something on that one. I'm going to store that, that tidbit away for the maybe one other time Terrell Harris gets referenced in a conversation in my sports life. Thanks, Woody. I appreciate it. Sorry it wasn't better. You're very welcome, my friend. Anyone else for tonight? Anyone else? Before I hop off and get some shut eye. See Jimmy Thals? What's up, fellas? guys i'm gonna give it two more minutes two more minutes and then i'm dead time if uh we don't have uh, another purchase then if we do i'll extend another minute or two i'm obviously getting tired the uh i think the late night live streaming three four hours of sleep and then right back to work is uh finally catching up to me i think i need to get a, a solid couple hours here solid eight hours tonight So last, last call, last, last call. last call one more minute one more minute on last call here before uh before buff goes to bed he's sleepy it's a short stream for me only uh like four and a half hours i think but oh my sleep number is calling me all right, last one. Last, 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 last call. Ten more seconds before I sign off for the evening, fellas and ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Nothing. No one. Nada. Zippy. Zilch. All right, I think that's going to do it for me then, guys. I, uh, I appreciate the purchases, as always. Um, tomorrow is Friday, uh, so I will work on... Well, I'll work on it the best I can for shipping. I'll probably post an update on Twitter. Um, yeah, my guess is going to be it's going to be Monday for everything from yesterday and today. Um, just because I, I don't I don't think I can, I have work tomorrow and I don't think I can get it all done before Saturday morning. Um, I can I might try. I gotta see. I also have a a, a teleconference thing tomorrow after work for an hour or so. Yeah, I'm going to have to... I'll do my best, but I will, I'll give you guys an update on Twitter on shipping as soon as I can. So if I can't get it out on Saturday morning, it'll obviously be Monday, but it definitely won't be later than that. So I thank you guys for your patience and all your purchases, and I hope you guys enjoy the other streamers the rest of the night. And um, I might be back on tomorrow, Saturday. I don't know. I really got to just check my schedule. I'm kind of playing things by ear right now. So um, you guys have a nice night, and I'll catch you when I catch you. And enjoy the rest of the uh, NFL draft. Later, guys.